Hello, hello everybody, it's me Cooper and I'm gonna be getting our stream started for the day. Yes, I'm gonna have this stream start with me having hiccups. I feel like that's the best way to start this stream. I am so screwed for the day. The second I started having these hiccups, like five minutes before I was supposed to stream, I was like, ah, <laughs> there it is again. I was like, oh, this is gonna be a day. This is gonna be one heck of a day. So we'll see how it goes. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be fun. I can already tell we're going to be having some fun today. Uh, we got a few minutes till the stream actually starts, so if you're watching this on YouTube, go ahead and just take your time. Uh, uh, take your time. <laughs> Never mind. Skip ahead. Just skip ahead to when the stream actually starts. You don't want to be wasting your time or none of that n nonsense. Right now, I'm just setting up the stream. This will be our first stream, everybody, with... You guessed it. Ken Yu is our partner. Yes, Mr. Ken Yu. <laughs> Which is the Mushroom Man. I don't... I, I cannot believe he was actually chosen as our next partner. The people in my chat were pretty... We had four votes for him. That's the mo most votes we ever got for anybody. And it was like eight votes in total, which is the most votes we've ever had. Hey! Yeah, can, can you can handle... Can you handle the hiccups? No. No, I cannot. The hiccups are going to be here for as long as they decide to be here. And there's nothing I can do about them. Welcome to the stream, Zero Immortals. Happy to have you here. So yeah, for now guys, I'm just going to be setting up the stream, posting stuff where I can. Hopefully getting through these hiccups before the stream actually starts at 4 o'clock, because that's going to be sucky. <coughs> oh, there it goes. Alright, yep, me and Ken, you are going together. Today's going to be a weird day. It's either going to go really good or really bad. Who knows? We'll figure that out together. Alright, let's do this first. Got to put out my messages to make sure everyone knows we're streaming. <laughs> Kenyu was the fan favorite. Yes, Kenyu got four votes. Easily won the... Easily won. He never... No one has ever gotten that many votes before. So he easily won that. Alright, let's see here. I'm almost done posting all my stuffs. So just give me one more second. Good old Twitter. Good old hiccups. <laughs> All right. There we go. Ah, <sighs> just getting set up, guys. Just getting set up. I feel. I feel like I'm almost ready. Uh, I don't even know, man. Like, I'm in the same boat. I don't even know if he gets hearts. I don't know anything, like, what's going to happen right now. It's going to be weird. I have made some new decks for the day. Hey, what's up, Arturo? Can you handle this stream? Oh, God damn it. That's how today's going to go. <laughs> I need to beat his story immediately. I don't know if I can handle the stream, though. My hiccups won't allow it. They, uh... Maybe they're nerves. These are nervous hiccups because I know I'm about to start dueling with my best bud, the Mushroom Man here. And I don't know if I can actually... I don't know if it's going to be successful or not. So, that, you know, I'm a little worried. I'm a little worried, I admit. Let's check our status. We are still a C-minus student. A little bit better, actually. We're doing a little bit better. And there it is. Another Can You joke. Can you handle your hiccups? I cannot. Oh, God. I cannot. Uh... Oh, man. Hey, guys, look at Ken Yu's stats. This is about as good as he's going to be. Zero wins, zero losses, zero draws. That's as good as it's going to be. So I hope you're all happy with that. It's about time to get this stream started. So for everyone that made it here, get ready to watch the, the Mushroom Man himself duel. Um, Hey, what's up, Inuyash guy? Welcome to the stream. I'm going to get started now. And is Dorothy... Are we able to duel her now since she was a choice? I'm going to check. Oh, God. Okay, sure. Okay, we can't tag duel her, but we can duel Dorothy. I'm going to do everything I can to help Ken you score. <laughs> or, so this is a brand new opponent. We've never fought Dorothy before. She's apparently on lock now. And uh, we're going to try it. Alright, Dorothy 2 versus the Black Skull Dragon. He puts freaking Mushroom Man in his deck. 
Oh, it's Dorothy and the Dark Magician Girl. Uh, a spitting image, ain't it? Oh, yeah. You know what? You and Trumbly will probably... Trumbly's probably into it. Let's see how if my deck can handle this. Okay, we're gonna go with this, just a standard start. Nothing special. There we go. I don't know how good or bad Dorothy is, so I'm gonna play it safe. Let's figure it out together, everybody. Let's figure it out together. And don't worry, she did nothing. She might be terrible. Starting to consider the fact that she might be terrible. Can you versus Thor Dorothy? How about this? Let me let me soften her up first, and then we'll send Can you into the the pit of hell. I would have done a tag duel with Can you against Dorothy, but she apparently doesn't have a partner. Which that's actually the first time I've ever seen that. All right, go for it, Dorothy. Hey, and Yashi guy, don't you dare judge Dorothy. She looks like a damn, wait, a, a damn fine lady. What is this? Oh, she must have a bunch of level five monsters in her hand right now. She can't summon anything. That's her problem. Okay, that makes sense. Well, I can only do uh, like 2100 damage, so I'm just gonna do that. The second she's able to summon something, because right now I'm assuming she has only level five monsters in her hand. Seeing as she runs the card Saber Slasher, which, oh my god, that's terrible. I have Magic Cylinder in case she does draw anything. She cannot draw anything. What did she just throw away now? Oh my god, it's Morifin or something like that. Holy crap. Dorothy is a queen. That is, you're damn right, Zero Immortals. You're damn right. So, I don't even know what I'm doing here. I'm just going, I'm just playing the video game. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let, uh, I, I was gonna soften her up just to see if our Mushroom Man buddy can handle her. I think I might let Ken you try. I might let Ken you try. This is just free experience. Unless she actually draws something that isn't level 5. Let's look at this, level 5 Morinfen. Okay, what are you gonna throw away this time? Level 5 Crawling Dragon, oh my god. And let's end the duel. Uh, oh shit, yeah, I forgot, it doesn't count. This is just sad, I agree. I agree. Let's let's just end this. She does not deserve to be tortured. She's a she's a mighty fine lady. She always gives us the cards that we need. I really appreciate it. Dueling is pretty fun. What? It's already over? Uh, you, you didn't Yeah, you didn't summon anything. All right, we're going to let we're going to let Mr. Mushroom Man give it a shot. So let's see what he can do. Let's see what can you It looks like he does have hearts everybody. Let's see what can you can do. I'm not I'm going to put the controller down. I ain't touching nothing. We're just gonna watch and see if our partner can do it. I mean, people, uh, uh, my friend uh, Jason voted for her. Mr. Boldman's himself. That's a spitting image right there. I don't know, let's see. The Mushroom Man Ken Yu versus Dorothy. He already drew his Mushroom Man, the duel is over. Ooh, Karate Man. Of course, yes, he runs the card Muyan Curry to heal himself by 200 points. Wouldn't you? That's a great card. I think it's great. Alright. Just do a basic attack with Karate Man. Don't do your attack increased attack. Unless she does finally summon a monster. Yeah, you have to draw a card. Oh my god, we have to teach her how to play. Okay, so you gotta draw a card. Hey, what's up, Ace? Thank you for putting the Dream Clown emote. I love to see it. Oh my god, she can't do shit. Like, she, uh, she probably only has, like, one monster in her deck that she can actually summon. He got Griggle! Oh, he's going in, guys. He's going in. I would summon Mushroom Man, but, yeah, he's going in. Hey, it's the Mushroom Man. We're... Oh, my God. Why are you giving the Mushroom Man to your opponent? What was the point of that? You just gave her something to tribute! Wait a minute. Wait a minute. This could be horrible. Wait a minute, this this could this is a terrible play by my partner. He should have done the damage, and then if he really wanted to, you she and spy in, in the main phase two. Oh boy, what is this is my partner. You know what? It's okay. He, he killed it, so there's nothing for her to tribute. I'm guessing she only has high level monsters, yes. Because watch what happens every time she discards. If she only has level five and up, then we gotta be careful that our friend here doesn't give her a card to summon. Yeah, this is a level 5 monster. It's Aitsu. He's not going to attack her with Mushroom Man? Go in with Mushroom Man. Do it. Get her. Okay, let's see what level 5 she had that time. Oh my god, Saber Slasher again. Yeah, go in, buddy. Get her. The Mushroom Man. He put Mushroom Man in his deck. 
He's gonna win this duel because she does not have a single card she could summon, apparently. And people said Ken Yu was the worst duelist. Uh-uh. I'm proving to you now. She is not the worst duelist. Oh, he's going all in. All in. There is no contest here. I, I cannot believe that, like, she can't summon anything. She doesn't even have soul exchange. or Would she even know how to use it? That's my question. She has trouble understanding what the draw phase is. She probably wouldn't even know what to do with Pot of Greed. This is a duel between the two worst duelists in the school, I'm assuming. Alright, 300. I would summon your other Griggle, since, uh... Yeah, this is our partner. This is our partner. This is our partner's deck. I hope you're all getting a good, uh... A good idea of what we're working with. This duel is perfection, in my opinion. I love it. I love it. I don't care what anyone says. He could summon monsters. She can't do shit. What'd she throw away this time? Octoburster. See, that is a good card if you're playing Falsebound Kingdom. If you're not playing Falsebound Kingdom, who cares? There we go. 350. You know what? Next turn, he'll pull off a victory if he can draw one of his better monsters, like the Karate Man. Or, you know, worst case scenario, I don't know, something something good. She doesn't play anything, guys. I'm done. I'm done. We're never going to duel her again. What was this level 5 monster this time? Machine Attacker. 5 stars, 1600 attack, 1300 defense. Adorable. Alright. Now that Ken, you got a win, let's be very careful. He did it, everybody. <laughs> Ken, you won a duel. His very first duel, he won. Yeah, honestly, no, none of my partners have won their first duel by themselves. This is the first time it's ever happened. Alright, so what happened? Really? I lost? I won. <laughs> Ken Yu's excited because he's like, I won. It's time to go to class. Ken Yu, you gotta learn something about me, buddy. We ain't going to class. That's the only one he's gonna get? Uh-uh, we're about to prove you wrong. Watch this. Let's go over to the Haba. And at the Haba, we'll find some duelists that are skipping class. I'm hoping. No one's skipping class? Okay, well then, I... Okay, screw it. We're gonna have to wait until people get out of class to duel them. Uh, we'll probably hang around uh, the Slifer Red Dorm. I feel like that's an area... Well, somebody... Son of a... No! No, I'm keeping Ken you safe! Away from the Shadow Riders, away from those spir duel spirits. They're way too powerful. Let's find a Slifer Red. Can you does have that? No! <laughs> you Bell and Zay, why are all these powerful people here? Okay, we got Kura. That's a raw yellow, though. Where's a. Where's double Slifer Reds? Double raw yellow. Double Obla's blue. Hey, at least Kenyu doesn't judge me when I don't. Uh, when I don't make him go. Or when we skip class. Yeah, you Bell and Zane is not a combo we can fight. Oh my god, where are the two Slifer Red combos? I know they exist. They're somewhere. Okay, here. Two Slifer Reds. This will be our first tag duel. I'm using a deck that's uh, based around the Black Skull Dragon. Um, can you... Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna... Can you avoid having a du to duel a horrible combo? Yes, I just did. We're gonna duel Hayden and Michael with Kenyu. And he's Kenyu's using his second deck. So technically, this is his improved deck. It's not his worst deck. Okay, he started with Mother Grizzly. I like that. Or Sangan. Mother Grizzly or Sangan. I like it. Does he have a card that works with Mother Grizzly? We don't know, but we'll find out. Nudoria is very powerful, though. Okay. Oh, it's Amoeba, isn't it? Oh, okay. Well, second Mother Grizzly. You know what? That's fine. Oh, dick. Oh, shit. All right. This is going to suck, kind of, because no matter what, I'm going to lose my monster. But they have to choose which one I'm losing, so that's good. Alright, here we go. There we go. Alright, so which one do you want to kill? You're going to kill my big bad Red Eyes Darkness Metal, or are you going to kill my big bad Red Eyes Dark uh, Red Eyes Black Dragon? Yeah, even when I didn't want I tried to stop him from killing it. It doesn't matter, we still get a Red Eyes. I can believe it's stream time, Dragon. You freaking Ken Yu jokes. Oh my god. Freaking Ken Yu jokes. I'm so I'm gonna get so tired of this. I I, I am gonna I'm gonna end up hating everybody in my comment section. I, I really am. Or in the chat. This isn't YouTube. Sasuke Samurai, oh boy. 
But you know what? Is long oh crap! That's uh, that's not good. That's actually a little funny though, because now we can do a ton of damage. If we could draw Amoeba, if he could draw Amoeba, can you can win win the duel? If can you can draw Amoeba? Ah, oh, damn! Wait, he got premature burial. Can you as premature burial? Holy crap! What is this play? What's going on here? Get the Karate Man out here. Oh, we don't even need it. Holy crap. Can you want us the duel? Can you handle his power? He won. I didn't do anything. He just did it. <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait a minute. You guys, you guys told me he was a bad partner. Wait a minute. <laughs> Can you be bad? <laughs> Holy crap. Now, we didn't win within three turns, but we won in general, and that's impressive. He top deck premature burial, and that happened. All right, let's go see if we can find a little more Slifer Reds before I throw Kenyu into the, the Devil's Pit, which is the horrible cards. Hey, look, more Slifer Reds. First things first, though. Fair of the cat. Pet his throat. <gasps> Happy Pat! Yeah! Hey, I don't mind being carried if it's by Kenyu. We can do this. I believe in Kenyu. I didn't think he would have broken cards like Premature Burial. I thought he was going to have an ass deck. Creature Swap makes sense for his deck, because his deck is all about giving your uh, his cards to the opponent. But I didn't think he would have Premature Burial. Oh, shit, I forgot to put Tag Duel. Freaking hell, that's on me. Don't worry, I'll beat Moses real quick. That was my bad. My intention was Tag Duel. That was my intention. I also run Creature Swap to make his deck uh, easier to use. If he has Magic Cylinder, that would be great. Oh, it's Moses. I forgot. This guy's going to be annoying. This guy's going to be problematical. All right, I'm going to go with Troop Dragon in attack mode because I'm not a coward. Okay, he's got one trap, which won't stop us. I'm going to have to let him heal a little bit because I am going to go for the creature swap. He gets 500 life. Okay, well, he's going to get a little more than 500, but it's fine. I'm saving my trap card for a big heal like Draining Shield. Give me your Dancing Fairy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Enjoy your enjoy your heal. Because now this turn is going to be very painful for you. I'm going to have a bunch of wind monsters. There we go. There we go. God, I wish I still had Plasma. <laughs> it's been so, I, I've been getting three monsters on the field very easily. You'd think Plasma would come in handy. But you know what? We're done with the Aster Phoenix part of our life, so we don't need to go back there. Okay, and that's... I don't know what that does, but I feel like we're fine. Oh, I do know what that does. Hold up. That's going to make it so he takes even more damage. Yay! Yes! Time to murder. Okay, activate MST. Going to get rid of your heal. Alright, Moses, you can do whatever you want. You like to heal yourself, you can heal yourself. I, myself, like to summon the Red-Eyes Black Dragon. I think your Red-Eyes is a great card. Even better than your monster with its buff. The channel owner? Oh, yeah, I kind of... Look, we was we were working with Atticus and... Or, yeah, Atticus, the channel owner, and uh, we kind of just got the channel back because he sucked he was a t like he was not the worst partner i still say aster phoenix was probably our worst partner but he was not a great partner solemn wishes the duel's over he can use solemn wishes if he wants so i don't even think atticus really owns the channel anymore he didn't do good enough to own it oh shit thank god i attacked with red eyes mr elf would have screwed us that and i already did the math this is exactly enough there we go my best partner, it might have been Jaden. It might have been Jaden. Jaden was an insanely good partner. All right, this time we're going to try again, but with, with actual Ken Yu. I, I did not mean to do a single duel. If I did Ken Yu versus Atticus, you understand Ken Yu would die, right? You understand that Ken Yu doesn't stand a chance against Atticus. No offense to Ken Yu. I saw he did good, but let's all admit it. He needs a lot of help. His creature swap strategy is the best he's got.
Okay, this is... Oh, he drew Sangan at least. I was gonna say, this is an interesting hand. I like this trap. Michizuri is a good trap for somebody like him. Reign of Mercy, I don't know if I like that, because you're gonna heal them, but... Hey, you know what? He healed us for a couple points. I guess that's fine. Hey, we got the Dream Clown e uh, emote. I love it. Alright, let's see what happens. Yeah, honestly, this is good. Sangan with Michizuri is really good. Boom. Can you with a good play? And he got Mother Grizzly. I would have gotten Mother Grizzly too. Nice, nice job. Nice freaking job. I got Brain Control, seven tools. I'm just going to go in. All right, I'm just going to go for a direct attack. If we need it, I'll set the scapegoats just in case, because I am in defense mode now, but we might as well do the damage. Can only act this when your opponent declares attack with a monster who has been tribute summoned. Oh, okay. Oh, that's not a tribute summon. Oh, crap. That's not good. That's not good. Moses, I, I have brain control, so I'm not that worried, but it's not good either way. Okay, we're just going to activate a little bit of scapegoat. Make sure Kenyu's got some protection. I'll, 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 if we find Atticus, I'll let them fight. I will let Kenyu fight Atticus. I'm just saying, don't get your hopes up, okay? I love Kenyu too, okay? I love him too. And I don't want him to suffer, but he might suffer. Goblin Decoy Squad, what is that? Mother Grizzly, heck yeah, they attacked in the wrong order. Mother Grizzly, nice. Let them fight. <laughs> I like that. Alright, do I draw red eye? I need to draw red eyes. I did not draw red eyes, so not much has changed. Not much has changed. We might as well get rid of Mr. Goblins. Okay, what was it? Draining Shield. That was expected. Honestly, I'll pay a thousand to make sure they don't gain fourteen. Wonder if I, I don't think I have any water monsters in my deck, so sadly Mother Grizzly's not going to work for us. But who knows? Maybe they'll tribute summon. Nope. Oh crap! Dunamis. Oh crap! Dunamis is a good card. I guess I'll activate it, but I don't think I can. Oh, shit! King of the Swamp! Ha <laughs> ha! Never would have expected that. That's cool. Never mind. We had a card. I'll take it. At least we get to keep some cards. Mushroom Man number two and some curry. When did, when did you take that guy? When did you take Professor Satir's class? All right, at the moment we're on the uh, back foot. We're in trouble, but I'm sure we can make a we can make something happen. Mushroom Man number two is gone. Troop Dragon is gone. Sadly, Kenyu does not have any Troop Dragons, but he did get to shuffle his deck, so maybe that'll help. Okay, let's see what we got. Hey, Exploder Dragon. That's a card I've been looking for. All right, let me see what we're look, working with here. Well, the problem with this is I don't have a trap to stop their traps, so if they have something like Wabaku, we're in trouble. Uh, at the same time, though, I don't really have much time to dilly-dally. We're, we're running out of cards here. I could brain control, but... Uh, uh, you know what? I'm not going to. Let's just... I, I think they have Wabaku, so watch this. Watch. Never mind, they didn't do it. It's fine. Can you? We have two more cards down. We're good. I'll trust Can you with my brain control. Shining Angel, not that bad. It sucks that they're gonna have something to special summon if Can you does manage to overpower it, but I'm assuming Can you can't. Griggle, yeah, go Griggle. Did just use Wabaku on Griggle. Did they just use a Wabaku on Griggle? God dang it. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Can you... I, the second I saw Gauntlet Attack Force, I was like, the duel's over. Uh, yeah, we are going to barely lose by 50. Yep, yeah, okay. Oh, wait, that, he still had the Gauntlet Attack Force on that side. It's okay, can you? It's okay. Don't worry. We'll find you a better opponent. We can do it, buddy. We can do it. At least you were able to win one duel, right? So we'll find you more. Or two duels, technically. Let's go over to the forest. Let's see if there's anyone lurking in here that you might be able to face. 
We need to get you some practice duels after all. Hmm, dang. Trying to, I mean, I'll do Slifer Red with Raw Yellow, but I won't. Oh boy, that's two very powerful people. Yeah, I'll blame myself on that one. I'll blame myself. But to be fair, I, I didn't have any options to win that duel either. I'll take the blame. I don't want Ken. You, I don't want Ken you to be in trouble. He's fine. But let's find. Oh God, no! <laughs> it's all these opponents that I just don't want Ken you to ever have to face in his life. Oh my God! Look at these horrible, horrible opponents. Screw it. All right, screw it. We're gonna try. I know there's an obelisk blue involved in this duel, but we gotta try. What the hell? The internet just go down. Hold the phone going on here says I'm connected hold up okay I'm back I'm back I don't I think that was just a random disconnect we should be okay everybody we should be okay Hopefully you guys are coming back. All right. There we go. That should work, guys. Just refresh your stream. Refresh your stream. It happens. It happens. Just refresh the stream. We should be good. We should be good. I don't know why, the, why that went out. It was not crazy. Don't be... It's not crazy. We should be okay. Crowler would bully Kenyu so bad. Son of a person. No. Not on your first turn. The first turn he got Mass Beast. And he's got Grand Tiki. Oh boy. Oh boy. That ain't good for us. But you know what? We have double creature swap. We got gr double creature swap. And he chose Amoeba. I love it. If only I had... If I drew a creature swap, then we're in the... We're in the cl I have creature swap. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. We are completely okay. Nothing bad is going to happen to us. Now, the idea that you guys might be thinking is like, I should just use the Red Eyes Darkness Metal. But I have to be careful with that trap, so I need my Mirage Dragon. So what we're going to do instead is we're going to attack the Grand Tiki guy. No. And because Ken Yu chose uh, this uh, this amoeba, and I also happen to run Creature Swap, this will be perfect. We get the Mass Beast. And he takes 2,000 damage. Look at that. Look at that. And remember, I could have never done that without Ken Yu. Ken Yu was a vital part of that plan. Alright, now we can do this. Now this is possible. Now it's safe to do it. There we go. There we go. We got the Mass Beast. We got Red Eyes Darkness Metal Dragon. We got everything. This is this is good. I would I would say Chumley, but we don't know yet. Can you just set me up perfectly? The Mother Grizzlies into Amoeba was the perfect setup for that turn. We did so much damage. All right, there we go. And he's using Karate Man's effect. I was hoping he would use his other amoeba, but that doesn't seem to be the case. Green Baboon. Oh, that's not actually that scary because we're stronger than Green Baboon. Yeah, actually, that's even Karate Man could kill Green Baboon right now. Oh, what is that? Ah, lowered our attack points. You know what? It's fine. We still have a lot of powerful monsters. 1800 damage. Oh my god. Oh, man. We are about to... Oh, my God. He could just use Amoeba next turn on his next turn and win the duel. He could literally use Amoeba on the next turn and win the duel. It's over. It's over. As long as we could survive until his turn, we won the duel. I don't I don't think we're in any danger. I think I... Did I... We lose three Dark Monsters? No, nah, we didn't lose three. All right, so Dragon's Mirror doesn't work yet, so that means I don't have enough. Let me activate this. We don't need Red Eyes in the Graveyard. Red Eyes is a good card. All right, next we are going to use some attacks. We'll go with the freaking... I want to keep my Red Eyes, so let's go with Mass Beast, just in case they have a trap card. Yep, they did. It was the Mask of Restrict. 
That's why. That way I can keep red eyes just in case we need his effect later. There we go. Mass Beast was nice, but we're done with Mass Beast. Let's get rid of Amoeba on the field. That way we can use Amoeba's effect again. I'm going to let Kenyu win. I'm not going to be able to win on this turn. Don't worry. Kenyu's going to win us this duel. Here we go. Oh, I haven't gone that far in Yashiga. I had to take a break from Digimon due to family uh, things. I haven't recorded any... Okay, Amoeba, Creature Swap, Win Duel. No! Use your strat... It, it was a free strat. Okay, he, we still win. Can you won us the duel, but it would have been funnier if he just won by damage. By effect... I mean, by effect damage. Alright, guys. Can you won the duel. He did it. <laughs> we beat an Obelisk Blue. Mixed with a Slifer Red, but we did. You know what? I'm a little... I know I know. I should be doing the duels, but I'm a little curious. Is it, Are you guys okay if I let Ken you try just to see? Like, I'm really curious. I want to know. I, I'm going to do it. I, 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 I'm going to do it. I, I'm super curious. Uh, I don't know about Ken you versus Crowler. That doesn't seem like something I would want to do. But Ken you versus Ch Chumley, that might be doable. All right. He's got Chien Spy and Amoeba and Griggle already. I kind of like this start. Ooh, but Chumley's got the heals. Uh, wait, no way. You got Frenzy Panda. Okay. Can you? Yeah, yeah. You need to save your Karate Man next time. He's not a good first turn. He's good when you're going for the attack. Okay, Mushroom Man, go ahead. By 50 points, Mushroom Man number two got him. Are you going to give the opponent your Mushroom Man, though? Yes, you are. So he pays 500 life points to give Chumley. I think it's 300 damage. So that was 250, but I think he does 300 damage. Oh, God. The duel is over. He drew Big Koala. Guys, I, I, I apologize. There's no way Ken you can beat this. Kenyu does not... Kenyu's boss monster is this right here in his hand. This mushroom man here. Holy crap. Chumley is not playing around. Ooh. Oh, boy. He's still in the duel technically. I just don't know how he's going to win. Top deck powers activate. Yeah, that's possible. Oh, good. He got the curry. Yeah. The second I can edit his deck, that's leaving the deck. Okay, now summon Amoeba and Yushien Spy. Nope. Okay. Wow. Okay. Okay. Okily dokily. You, you still... You still had to pay the 500 life points. Okay, he doesn't know how to use his own deck, guys. Technically, he did damage to Chumley. That's all I can say about this. And he's going to win by exact damage. You see, guys, I can team. I, if I team up with Kenyu, we stand a chance. But let's let's give the kid a break, okay? Let's give the. It's okay, Kenyu. Don't worry. It's okay. We're gonna get you stronger. As we duel together, we're gonna improve your deck and make you a stronger duelist. Ivan with Maki. Oh, Maki beat us a lot. I might, I might uh, not want to do that. All right. Oh, is it suddenly two? There's no dialogue. So because there's no dialogue, he doesn't say, hey, don't you want to sleep? All right, let's see. I'm going to go to the abandoned dorm. We need to do we need to do a, a time skip episode where we get him some experience. As long as those 99 cards were nothing, it meant nothing to you, Sinister Shadow. You could obviously just get rid of useless cards. Flare Scarab, though, I don't really care for. I think it's fine, but it's it's not the hardest card to get in the game. So, if that's what you're into, go for it. Okay, let's see. I didn't see anyone there. No, we're not going to go to class. Come on. You think Ken Usewer is ready for class? The man knows what he's doing. He doesn't need class. I, you guys agree with me, right? Ken Yu doesn't need any schooling. He's fine. He knows what he's doing. All right, anyone ditch class at the beach? Sometimes they do, so, you know, it happens. No. Okay, now the kid should be going. Enjoy your food, Mr. Anice. Let's go to the girls' dorm.
Yeah, he might need the spell class again. Fair enough. He might need that one. Alright. Is it literally just... There we go. I didn't see anybody. There were all the Slifer Reds hiding. Are they? They're at school. They're at school. That's what it is. They're at the school. Watch this. They're gonna be. They're gonna be right here somewhere. Okay. Well, there's one of them. How do I get back there? There we go. Hero, let's duel. Tag duel. All right, Arturo. Thank you for showing up to the stream, and thank, uh, I hope you have a good day, buddy. All right. Let's go. Come on, can you? You and me, we can take the. We can take on the world. I don't remember the spellcaster's name in the loading screen. It has like 400 attack, 400 defense. I, don't I think Dark Magician Girl uses it. Oh, he has Anteater Giant. Okay, so that's a new boss monster he has that I didn't realize. He has Anteater Giant. That's not terrible. Alright, I'm a little happy to see that. Does Mosquito, I'm not so happy to see. Alright, let's see. I got the Mirage Dragon. Ooh, it's already over. Okay, I'm going to summon Troop Dragon in order to special summon my Red Eyes Darkness Metal in order to special summon the guy who's going to stop trap cards, Mirage Dragon. And now we're going to set some stuff that might protect us later on. And we're going to commit to Mada. Nope, we won't need two pronged attack. Let's just get one of them spell counters down. And let's get the other one down. Well, unless they have a very powerful tribute monster, they're in danger. And I have Michizuri if they try to go after my Mirage Dragon. Future Fusion, I don't... Oh my god, she's the Brachioratus guy. You know what, no. You want to fuse that? That's fine. She's the Brachioratus person. I remember you. She kicked our ass with that card. Yeah, she wants to summon Bra That's the card I stopped. That's the one you wait for. See, that? <laughs> that that's, that's a problem. Because we're not scared of Brachioratus. We have a trap card. We have Anteater Giant. Look at this. Look at this. Eat that card. Ah, oh, I was missed to a Space Typhoon. Damn it. You can still summon Mushroom Man though, right? Oh, hell yeah. Oh, what the hell? You used my monster? Nice. Look at this power, everybody. Nice! He even chose the right monster to attack with. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Can you with the blaze? We'll take the 500. Give them the mushroom, man. It's fine. I know you love to do this to make them burn a little. Let's just hope they have nothing to tribute summon. There we go. Are you guys going to pay the 500 to give it back? They paid 500 more to give it back. This is working. Can you? Yeah, I love his ability. All right. Insect. Well, that's not going to work because I, I know we'll take 300. I'm just going to play this so we don't have to use Anteater Giant's effect. We could just do it like this. Put you in attack mode, and let's go. There we go. Anteater Giant, go in. And because it's Ken Yu, I'll let Mushroom Man do the job. Geek Boy, get out of here. You think I don't remember you? <laughs> oh, man. We are winning, guys. Ken Yu is really good. All right, let's go over to somewhere else. Find some more Slifer Reds that can you can handle. And then once we can buff his deck... <laughs> Jason, you can do whatever you think is necessary, buddy. You're, you're, in, you're my mod. You're in charge of whatever you think is right. He's a friend of mine, yeah. We used to play League together way back when. Uh, Rio... Oh, God, it's Ryu. Uh, Rio. Freaking uh, Vidal loves this guy for some reason. I don't, but Vidal does. Alright, let's go, guys. We're going to be doing some duels. We got Kenyu the Mushroom Man versus Ryo, the guy I don't remember at all. Let's hope for the best. Hey, we're going first. I love that. Let's see who wins this one. Sio oh, I remember Sion. Sion's actually a really hard opponent. We are in trouble here. Okay, at least he got Giant Rat. Giant Rat's a good start. Or Sangam, whatever he likes. Giant Rat with Michizuri. I like it. I like it a lot. Oh crap, it's other giant rat. It's card it, it's card ejector, good to know. 
penalty game when your opponent... Okay, I don't know what penalty... I, someone tell me what penalty game is. Magical Thorn, another card I'm not too familiar on. Alright, so I could do a couple of damage this turn. I didn't draw my Tribute Monsters. That's a little sh a little bit of a shame. It should be okay. 500 on Ken Yu. Dragon, you are a rich man if you're bidding 500 on Ken Yu. I respect it, though. I really do. I might not have any Earth Monsters now that I think about it, so... I'm just gonna do some direct damage this turn. I'll let Ken Yu do the... I'll let Ken Yu do the suicide play. I only want to kill them quickly, because once Yun gets a turn, it's over, guys. Yun's gonna just destroy us. And maybe Ken Yu can handle him with all of his creature swaps and Chien Spies and other bullcrap, but we'll see. Okay, and we'll play it safe, so Ken Yu doesn't have to worry about anything. Got Michizuri ready to go. And the Tricky. Okay, so that's going to be a little bit rough. Okay, that's not that scary yet. This is all up to Ken Yu now, guys. I've done everything I can I could. Another Michizuri. A Mushroom Man. He could go in with Giant Rat, which would be an interesting idea. He's going in with Giant Rat. I like it. I like it a lot, because now he can use Michizuri. And he can get rid of one of those cards. Okay. And he got another Giant Rat. I like it. And he has another Michizuri to do it again next turn. Good play from Ken Yu. Good play from Ken Yu. And now we're going to burn him a little with the Mushroom Man. They'll take 300 damage. My boy. Ah, they run Monster Reborn. Well, guess what? Ken Yu has my Magic Jammer. Hell yeah. Uh-oh. Tribute Summon. That's not good. That's not good. Mushroom Man was supposed to do a little more burn damage. Oh, let's okay. We'll figure it out. Well, that's gonna help. Uh, but they tributed that, so might, we might not be strong enough to kill it. If I could kill this, though, well, maybe you know what? The AI does make dumb plays sometimes, so if, there's a chance. Nope, that was just a super strong monster. Oh, it's the Cryo Sphinx, isn't it? Yeah, he's the Sphinx guy. It's fine. I, we'll still have swords, and you know what? Can you? You might be able to use this on your turn because you might figure something out. Plus, if he draws Amoeba, he's going to need my creature swap. Well, hello, Garuda. Hello, Harpy's brother. Oh, boy. You know what? I trust Ken Yu. We're out of swords. It's all up to him with his Sangan. Two-pronged attack could come in handy with Sangan. I believe in a play like that. Interesting. I like it. You're going to kill your own Sangan to draw another card. I like it. And Michizuri to get rid of that. Okay. Okay. I'm liking his play. And he drew Amoeba. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. We might burn him to death. Two-pronged attack. Okay. I would have kept Giant Rat, but you know what? You're, you do what you're into. And Magic Cylinder. If he can get a card with the Amoeba. Oh, my God. That would be the best thing ever. If he can draw Shien Spy or something like that. I have never... Kenyu is the best AI we've ever had. Alright, I have nothing, so we might as well just make sure the Harpy Brother dies. Holy crap, he's the best. He is literally the best partner we've ever had. Uh, I, it's up to him, though. I can't win the duel for us. I don't have any cards. Rising Erica, that buffs us. Ah, good play by the opponent. We're still in the duel, technically? Yeah, we're still in the duel, but that's, that's rough. Ooh, I don't know if... The only way we win is if he draws Shien Spy or Creature Swap. Top deck from Ken Yu. Creature Swap! Holy crap! <laughs> Holy crap, he won the duel! <laughs> he beat an Obelisk Blue! Ken Yu is a god. Kenyu is an actual god. Holy crap. I am like... I'm so happy right now. You... What the hell? What the hell just happened? Is... Is this the new king of games we're looking at? <laughs> that top deck was... Oh my god. That was so perfect. I am... That was so perfect. I'm the terrible... Holy crap. Holy crap, he had to top deck so that or his... Oh my god, that was great. I'm so happy. I thought we were lo we lost right there. But no, Kenyu doesn't give up. Kenyu does not give up. Whew. God damn.
Prediction ended. Oh, crap. Hey, Alexis is actually working with Jasmine. That makes that makes sense. Yubel is Zane. Uh, the Gambler with Truman. I don't know if I like that. Man, that was freaking cool. Kura with Fatty. Okay, we could probably do that. Maybe that. Probably be a tough duel, but we can do it. Plus, we almost got Kenyu's first heart full filled up. That's pretty nice. There we go. Alright, this duel's probably going to be a little harder. It's easier for us to win when we go second. You did it, Dragon. You paid up and you won. You believed in Ken Yu and he top-decked it. Okay, I got my scapegoat at least, but we didn't get much. That's true. They were kind of like separated from each other. He's got double Shien Spy, but he doesn't really have any cards to help himself. I don't know about this hand. Unless... What does Penalty Game do? Does anyone know what Penalty Game does? Someone want to help me out here? The game never gives me enough time to read it. Oh, nope, see, it, it just cuts out before I can read it. Your opponent skips their next draw phase? Okay, I, I think I read that. Dragon Monster. Uh, oh, if I drew Polymerization! If only I had Polymerization. Alright, well, I already know that this is going to be their Mirror Force watch. Wabam. Shit! Wait, Ember's Holiday? What does that do? They get the effects of all equipped cards. Oh, that's useless. Alright, this one's going to be a little harder on Kenyu. I want you to understand that right now. It's going to be a little harder. I could do a play right now, but it's not the best play in the world. It's just a play to keep us healthy. Okay, there we go. I wanted to save my thing for Kenyu, but I don't want them to have a tribute monster. We don't know what kind of cards they're rolling with. Sometimes they have Jinzo and it's just scary. I think they gave up. All right, good play. Can you? Do you have anything? Creature swap, Shien Spa, Shien Spa. You're giving them... At least put it in attack mode first. Can, can you? What are you doing? Can you? What are you doing? Can you? Why? Okay, his brain died a little bit. I think his brain died a little bit. It's okay. I still trust Can you? It was just a weird play. It was a weird play. I don't know why the AI thought it was a good play. But I should learn to trust the AI. Right, I'm just going to go for Wyvern. Do a little stamping destruction. Don't want to trust that one. Royal Decree. Interesting. Yeah, we need to take him to class so he can learn. The yeah, but there's no spell class. You there's only Alchemy class, Curry class, and uh, Shit on Slifer Red class. Either opponent cannot draw during the next draw phase or they cannot activate something. Oh, crap, they run Metal Reflect Sly. Uh, 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 that's good. Thank you for telling me it's effect, uh, Inuyasha guy. Metal Reflect Slime I didn't expect them to have. That's not good for us. But I, it, once I draw Polymerization, the duel's over. Premature Burial. Uh-oh. Wait, th is it just Sangan? Yeah, I was going to say, this duel isn't, hasn't been that long. Unless it's a double tribute. It's a single tribute. The hell is that thing? Metal Shooter? What is that? Oh, and Gym Class. I did forget about Gym Class. Fusion Gate? Oh, uh, it's freaking Metal Dragon! Hell yeah! I mean, I'm sad that we're going to lose everything, but it's it's Metal Dragon. Hell yeah. I just have to top deck, you know, a card that actually could save us. Or can you, if he uses Creature Swap, could do... Oh god. He could do at least use Creature Swap. There's no reason not to. He has two after all. Okay, well, yeah, he could just do nothing. That works too. Whatever makes him happy. Yeah, we can use Fusion Gate. So on my turn, I'm going to be able to fuse. And I'll put us back. I'll get us back in this duel. Alright, there we go. There we go. Get to summon my favorite card in all of Yu-Gi-Oh! The Black Skull Dragon. There we go. Now, let's see... What is your effect? When this card is no place, two cards on it. This card gains the under attack. This card would be destroyed by effect. Remove one card this card counters... Uh, this card contains instead. Gotcha. Well, let's start getting rid of the guarantees. Well, we'll work on this card later. No, Karibo was never my favorite card. Never. My favorite card is Black Skull Dragon. S close second would be Dream Clown. Dream Clown is up there. 
Oh yeah, it is KPA. Thank you. Hey, welcome to the stream. Well, that sucks. Metal Morph wasn't expected. Whatever. I believe in my partner, Can You. Here, have a troop dragon. Can you? Can you do something? If you could kill the baby. Oh, actually, they said a new card. If you can kill the baby dragon, maybe. Can you? You have creature stop at least. I know all we get is a baby dragon, but you could do it. No? Okay. Hey, we got a new follower. Graham Ham 94 x Welcome. I'm very happy to have you here. Thank you so much. Uh, we've won a lot of duels and we've lost a couple duels with our buddy Ken Yu here. Ooh, that's not good. Ooh, good play by the opponents. This is going to be one that we lose, though. It's already over. Oh, shit, he runs that card? I wonder why you put Baby Dragon in defense mode when the duel's already over. It's alright, Ken. You, you win some, you lose some. We're almost to your second... I mean, we're almost to your first heart, though. So, I mean, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. Alright. Hey, we got a new subscriber. Grahamham94x. Thank you so much for subscribing. I really appreciate that. You're an awesome person. Alright, guys. Let me go ahead and change our deck real quick. I already made a lot. I already had... We already used Exodia. We, we used an Exodia deck way back when. Uh, probably back in the Jaden series. Yep. All right. Let's load a recipe up. We've already had fun with the Black Skull Dog deck. I got some Black Skull Dragon, so I'm kind of done with that deck. I have a little bit more going on. Let's see. Dark Arm Bird. That'll do. This will be fun. You guys might enjoy this deck. Kenyu's biggest strength is that he has he has won us the duel by top decking twice now. Yeah. When I have to wait till the second heart to upgrade Kenyu's deck. I can't touch his deck yet. They won't, he won't let me. He's very self-conscious about it. Once, once I get him to, to be friendly with me more, he'll let me mess with his deck. Oh, good. Two Slifer Reds. Oh, God. Jaden's there. And Fonda. Yawn and Shannon. There we go. No, his his strength is that he can, he can do Creature Swap and he can do uh, some stuff with his Amoeba. It, it works out. It works out. Not all the time, but some of the time. All right, let's see what we got. Dark Arm Bird and Ken U2. He is a fun guy. Oh god, damn it! I knew I was gonna. I knew having Ken U as a partner was gonna be a problem, but this is this is not okay. Oh, you should just use Griggle with Shen Spy. Yeah, but he, Ken U is on a different level. Insect imitation. Interesting. Oh crap! It's Hercules Beetle. First turn, Hercules Beetle. That's gonna be interesting. Ken U, what is your plan? Your plan is giant rat. I like it. All right, Ken, you. We believe in you, and I'm gonna help you with my new deck. Okay, we got the Spear Reaver. We got Armageddon Knight. All right, I got some good stuff. I got Scrap Iron Scarecrow. All right, so no matter what, I can't exactly beat that card. I have a little bit of an idea, though. Okay, we're just gonna summon Armageddon Knight to get some stuff going. Okay, I could go for Necro, I could go for him. Yeah, I'm gonna go for one Necro. I have no idea why they spell Kenyu's name like that. I, I To this day, I don't understand it. We're in no danger from that guy, so I'm not that scared. We got Scrap Iron, we got Magic Jammer, we got MST. I'm feeling pretty safe. Hey, you finished the YouTube videos? Awesome, I'm glad you were able to come here too. I'm happy to have everyone that, uh, you know what? No, it's fine, it's fine. Warrior of Zera is not that scary. Yeah, it gets the buff. Oh no, it's fine. Uh, that's okay. We don't need Armageddon Knight. And I might waste his giant rat because I don't think I have a card like that. So we're going to scrap iron on that one. You're not going to lose any bits. We got this, guys. Whoa, some people bet for us to lose. That's the first time I've seen that. We got Monster Born. We got... Okay, so you wanted to MST now. I was going to save it just in case you were going to use Griggle, but... Okay, you brought back my Necro Gardener. That was a that was a play. I can't believe you have Monster Reborn in the first place. Okay, premature burial. What are you doing, buddy? What is my buddy here doing? What is he doing? No, no, no! Don't give. The, oh, wait a minute! Wait a minute! I am I'm I'm kind of into this. Wait a minute! I might be into what he's doing. Okay, what are you getting out of this? You got Mushroom Man. Mushroom Man. 
Okay, I don't I might not be up I might not be into this strategy anymore. What are you doing? Okay, we lost a thousand life points for you to give them two new monsters that'll do six hundred damage to them. That they might just end up tributing. We have Scrap Iron Gar Scarecrow. We will have Necro Gardener in the graveyard. They have a new Okay, and that's gone. Uh That's not good. That does piercing damage. I'm glad you scrap iron on that one. Okay. 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 They have to pay the 500 now, so that we'll take 300. They gave me a monster to tribute that I like. Problem. Even though I have Spirit Reaper, there's no protection. I, I have scrap iron, but there's no protection later on. All right, so I'm just gonna set Spirit Reaper. I'm going to end the turn. I'm gonna go ahead and let Mushroom Man go over there. Look, this is Kenyu's strategy. I believe in him. We're gonna use his strategy. Oh boy. Pandemonium's coming out. Which means Warrior of Zera might get upgraded. Nope. Just another Warrior of Zera. Okay, that's the one we're gonna scrap iron because that's the one you always need to scrap iron, Scarecrow. All right. You have a little faith in him? You should have a little faith in him. I believe in Kenyu, and you should too. Now, is he going to do anything for us this turn? No, he's just going to put some cards in defense mode maybe and, uh, you know, just fill up our field a little bit. But on my turn, we might be able to get the Dark Sigmorph, whatever. And that's when the car, that's when the game gets good. Polymerization, that I was not expecting. What are we fighting? Oh shit, it's Quagar Hercules! I love that card. It's really good in the Duels of the Roses series. My friend, uh, my friend Steven uses it in his deck. No, don't you scrap- a Oh wait, actually, it's fine. It's fine. Yes, it is fine. I didn't know that it was the beetle attacking. Never mind, we're good. Ken, you did good. And now I can summon Dark Sigmorph and get us back in this duel. Just in case this fails, though, I'm gonna Destiny draw swords. Yeah. Because once I get rid of Spirit Reaper, we're in trouble. Okay, just in case. Boop, boop. Okay, what does this one do again? It's been a while. Uh, your opponent cannot set any cards on the field. That's what it does. So if they have a trap to stop us, we're done. But, I mean, we gotta go in because we're losing life points too, uh, too quickly. They do not have a trap to stop us. We're still in the duel. If I can get my anti-spell fragrance, we're gonna win this duel 100%. Yep, that minimal, uh, that minimal love is all we need. As long as, uh, oh, they have swords too. Okay, that's not good. Let's see what our buddy here does. Interesting, that card could come in handy. That card could come in handy. Once that swords runs out, we're going in. Alright, ooh, wait. I was gonna set Wall of Illusion, but I like having a Wind and Dark Monster in my hand so that I could always get this card back. <sighs> yeah. Wall of Illusion would be nice, though, just in case they get Lightning Vortex. You know what? I'm gonna keep this. Yeah, I'm gonna keep this. I'm gonna keep this. The only reason I'm keeping it is because... and well, Oh, shit. Oh, no, we're stronger. We're stronger. It's fine. We're stronger. Nothing to fear. Your, my opponent can't set any cards. He screwed himself, honestly. He screwed himself. And I'll just use swords again on my turn. So this is okay. Two prompt attack. We gotta be careful with that. Because Ken Yu is a crazy man. He might actually try to use two prompt attack on our Dark Sig Morph. And that would be a problem. Hello, alien section. That's adorable. Or Alan section. Alan section? What the freaking hell is that? Brain control, interesting. That might come in handy. Hey, Dream Clown in the Bakura. Alright, so negate the effect of all equipped cards. You know what, that's just taking up space on our field. We don't know, need it. This one, on the other hand... Uh, tribute summon or set, destroy all face-up types of monster in your opponent's side of the field and put 1,000 points damage to your opponent's life points. See, I kind of like that. Kind of like that. In case things go wrong, I'm going to get my swords on the field. That way we still have an open slot to summon... And we'll figure this out from here. Who knows? Maybe he'll draw his uh, creature swap with Amoeba. And then we'll get to work like that. 
It's a slow win, but it's still a win if we get that. Oh, Mitch is already not bad. Yeah, he's not going to want to fill up the field, though, which is fine. His two-pronged attack is all that's kind of in the way. I'm waiting for them to just tribute summon because they have everything they need. All right, now it's my turn. Okay, now that I have two troop dragons, I'm willing to summon one of them. How much defense do these guys have? Everyone's too strong for troop dragon. All right, troop dragon, you can go down. I could brain control, but I'm kind of saving it for an emergency. Let's just work on their cards that are strong. Start with the Warriors of Zera. Only... Oh, God. I set a monster. He might accidentally use two-pronged attack. Um, I'm, get rid of the Warriors of Zera because he could summon a stronger card with that. Warrior returning alive. Okay, so he's still going to do that. Can you? You got to trust me, man. You never want to use your two-pronged attack. Please tell me you're smart enough to not use it. Unless you summon one of your monsters and you leave my Dark Sigmorph alone. That's the only time I'll accept it. That's Amoeba. I like Amoeba. Hey, there we go. Our opponent... Because my effect, uh, it doesn't really work out. Because then I won't be able to resummon if they if they end up destroying our monster. Hey, he did the blast with the tribute. Now they're going to take a thousand damage. Hell yeah. Because remember, since this is a tag duel, if I do it on my turn, sure, I could just resummon it. But then we lose the option to resummon it later. And it'll take even longer. Because then we have to wait for my turn, which is every two turns. Plus, it's just getting rid of one card. But now that I have this monster, we can use two-pronged attack if we need to. This is what we're going to do. We're going to do a little bit of an attack. Because if I attack this, then he's going to have to summon in attack mode. Uh, no big... Oh, he didn't... Oh, he doesn't have any. Okay, that makes sense. No big glitches. No, no big glitches. Nothing, nothing to write home about. All right, and I'll use two-pronged attack if I see him go for one of my monsters, because I could just activate it like a trap card. Plus, that'll make him summon in attack mode, which is what we want. All right, so we're just going to do a little bit of the two-pronged. I got to be very careful what I pick. Boopity, boopity. All right, funny enough, I'm a little more afraid of this card, since it has an infinite stall strat with Sanctuary in the Sky. I don't mind if they keep the beetle. There's no attack target anyway. Oh, wait. I forgot he had Mitchizuri on the field. Oh, this is easy. Boop. <laughs> Didn't expect my... Oh, my God. This is great. Get Shien Spy. We win the duel. Karate Man, we won the duel. <laughs> Go, Karate Man. I, I got that from the Joey Starter deck, so I'm glad to see it. Whoever bet for uh, Ken Yu to win us the duel, he won us the duel. It was a little touch and go there, but we were able to come out victorious. See, guys, we did it. Don't doubt the man. He can do things. He makes plays happen. Ah, and even that blast with the tribute came in handy. It did a thousand damage. All right. Can you? We are getting that heart up. All right. Let's go see. Uh, it's time to go class. We don't have a burn deck yet. I need to slow down on that. Let's go see what kind of cards we can get. Nice draw, Valiant Size. You got your prediction one. Let's see. We're going to go to the shop. I just have to waste time until after class. You got to wait for like midday. Yeah, like here. Dusk. Uh, let's go ahead and go inside the store. Because we made a lot of money, guys. Ken Yu has earned us so much money. Can you handle the... God dang it. Yeah, Ken Yu's got the burn cards. He probably would do pretty good in class. So there are a bunch of new packs, guys. Uh, last time we got the warrior pack, we bought a lot of the warrior pack. So I'm going to slow down on the warrior pack. And we're going to work more on the bug pack and the new other new packs. So let me get a little bit more of the bugs because I like the bugs. Okay, good. We're going to get the checkered flag pack, which is a new pack. I know it's expensive. It's definitely an expensive pack. I'm still going to buy a lot of it because it has Dual Academy on the picture and that looks cool. It has the dark version of Dual Academy on the picture. I like that a lot. A little expensive though. A little expensive. Oh, Sadie Special Pack is sold out right now. Damn it. I should have bought that. Oh, I mean, it wasn't available yet. I need to buy this pack so we can go to class. Her pack is the burn pack. Uh, there's I, I don't think there's a mar Mushroom Archetype other than one in Mushroom Man 1 and 2. But we can like pretend there is. And, like, just look for any cards that resemble mushrooms. There we go. There we go. 
Yeah, I wish Sadie's pack was available. I'd be buying the crap out of it right now. I do want to get more of the bug pack because this is technically the pack Ken Yu unlocked for us. It was this one right here. So let's see what we get today. Let's see. Gaga Gaga Gio, Warrior Deck Refer, DD Warrior Lady. Hell yeah. Yeah, I could technically build a plant deck for Ken Yu. The A Forces. The Lady of Wasteland. Oh, White Magician. Yeah. Mushroom Man. Hell yeah. Hanawa. I don't know why that's a rare. And Judgment Dragon isn't, but whatever. I need to get the Law of the Normal. That's a really good card that I want. Where's the Law of the Normal? Gravity Bind. Hell yeah. I think it's limited to one, though, so... Hey, I saw Law of the Normal. We got it. Hell yeah. Three, four, five. Hey, Metal Armored Bug. Gotta love it. Millennium Scorpion, all right. Ultimate Insect level seven, that's good. We need one more of those, two more level fives, and uh, maybe two more level three. I don't know about level three. Level five is the more important one. I don't know. I feel like I feel like he's carrying us. And in Yasha guy, I feel like he's carrying our our team right now. Can use uh, Mushroom Man's. They they're winning us the duels. That little burn damage they did in that last duel helped us win. Ooh, Insect Queen would be fun. Swarm of Scarabs, gotta love it. Phantom Cricket, don't know much about that. Yeah, Forbidden Memories is what really got me into the game too. So this is a new pack. And uh, I used to use Hanawa in that game for Fusion. Stray Lands... This is a weird pack. It's got a lot of cards I don't really recognize. Destiny Draw. Oh, interesting. Burfament? Eh, that's cool. You know what I'm still looking for? I haven't got Bickery Box yet. Somebody find me a Bickery Box. Supercharge. D3S Frog. Blast Juggler. I don't know. I feel like I have most of these cards. They're all. I guess it's all the cards we already can be buying. It's just the rares are all the same. So we got to get lucky either way. We got Gust, Wyvern. Ooh, Burn of the Mighty. I did need more of those. That's good. Black Pendant. That's a classic. Nightmare Horse. I like Nightmare Horse if I make a Director's Deck. Battle Fusion. I already had that. All right. Let's look at our new cards. We got Wolf. We got Celestial Angel, Light Sworn Angel. So we got some Light Sworns. We got the Law of the Normal, which I did need. Princess Karan, Metal Armored Bug, Laser Cannon, Millennium Scorpion, Ultimate Insect Level 7. That was a really good pull. Silent Strider. You can send this card from your graveyard to reduce level 1 monster on the field by 1. I guess that's for uh, Synchro Monsters. Phantom Cricket. Flip. Return one face down monster from the field. Top of its owner's deck. Oh, that's kind of good. Yeah, the, the Directors. It's a deck I made back in Tag Force 2 and it ended up being like really broken. Hyper Hammerhead was a really good get. Yeah, it's a, it is definitely a mix. Yeah, Checker Vlad's a mix of all the packs we could have been buying. And we actually got some new cards from it. Like this is the Earth Pack, Destiny Draw Woody, the other pack, Volcanic Counter. That's the Fire Pack, or the actually no, that might be Aster's Pack since he had those other cards. Bait Doll, Plague Wolf, Red Ogre, Mysterious Guardian. I don't know that. I don't know that guy. Pyramid of Light's fun. Nightmare Horse. I did one. That's a card I wanted, especially since I have Spirit Reaper. I just need the Fusion now. All right, we're going to leave that be. We got some cards. Yeah, we got Destiny Draw. Oh, wait, so Sadie, can we duel you, or is that just not a thing yet? Yeah, okay, so she doesn't know what to do yet. We'll, we'll learn. We'll, she'll, we'll teach her. Hey, it's Pharaoh. Pharaoh, do you want a little throat scratches? A little throat scratch? No, you don't like it? Oh, okay, I'm sorry. Maybe next time. All right, let's go. Can you? I got places to be. We're going to check out the classroom after dark. Yeah, zombie decks are really fun. I use a couple zombie decks myself. Am I good with them? Eh, more or less. Not really great. I've been... I've, I've had better luck with other decks. Have you guys noticed I've done a lot more tag duels since uh, Ken Yu's joined the group? I just really love this guy. Eh. 
eh. I don't really like to buy packs three or four at a time. That's That takes even longer. Even if it did alter card drops, I, I I like I like the mass buying. It makes me feel makes me feel more uh, more of a rush, and it doesn't make me uh, doesn't make me wait every time I want to buy more. All right, ooh, Shen Spy with Griggle and Mother Grizzly's a good start. Do not start with Karate Man. There we go. All right, so he's got a pretty good start. Worm Gurus. I don't know the Worm Monster that well. Never mind. I kind of remember this Worm Monster, and I don't like it. We're going to need a powerful card to take on that worm. Dark Sigmorph would have been nice, but I don't technically have the card I need to summon it, do I? No, I do not. Uh, Heavy Storm would probably be a good play right now. Okay, we got rid of Book of Moon. That's already a good thing. Yes, Armageddon Knight. Let's see. You know what? In this case, I'm actually going to throw away my other Dark Sigmorph. Let me check to see. It doesn't work yet, but it's fine. I have Magic Cylinder. There we go. Reinforcements of the army. Ooh, that's going to be bad. That's like three monsters on the field. Double Marauding Captain Strat. That's rough. Luckily, we get to keep our monsters, but that is rough. I don't want him to attack and gain more attack points. That does stop him, right? Yes, it did stop him. Good. Now, I don't know what your strat... Karate Man could technically beat that thing. Why are you Shien spining? Why did you do this? Why Why are you like this? Please get rid of Guru. Thank you. Alright, he at least got rid of Guru. That's good. I don't know why he Shien spied my Armageddon Knight. He's, he's not good with his spell cards yet, guys. He needs more practice. He needs a little more practice. And Warm Gurus is back. And Mother Grizzly is going to summon another Mother Grizzly. Nope, he doesn't have another one. That's Amoeba, and we are going to take some damage. We have lost everything. Unless I draw a Wind Monster. If I draw a Wind Monster, we're coming back. Unless, do I have enough Dark in the... Yeah, how many Dark do we have in the graveyard now? One. Two. Just two. Okay, if I can get one more Dark Monster in the graveyard, we are good. So let me go ahead and summon this. Oh, shit, I can't attack, can I? Hold up. Oh, he's not a warrior. I can't attack him. I can't attack... Oh, and this is Mirage Dragon, guys. He can't be stopped by trap cards. Or your opponent cannot activate trap cards during the battle phase. Okay, we stopped that worm before it became too powerful. That's the good news. I have Spirit Barrier in a different deck I made, funny enough. And next turn, I could summon Dark Arm Dragon. But my friend here my friend uh kenyu needs to make it so we survive till my turn giant rat will do that okay what are you oh could marauding you know what that's a good play get rid of marauding captain i do have a deck today where i have spirit barrier in it all i have three of them because it's so valuable dark arm dragon is on its way guys we're gonna use it and we're gonna win this duel all right boop uh, I wish I drew a wind monster. We could have summoned two big pow powerful cards. Okay. There we go. Dark Arm Dragon's effect. Activate it to... Let's say... This guy. Let's need a card to destroy. Boop. Oh, it's still got its effect off. Dang. Alright, I guess that's fine. I'm gonna summon the Spirit Reaper. I could just keep destroying cards, but we already know the trap cards won't stop us. They haven't activated any of them yet. There we go. The reason Spirit Reaper's in attack mode is to make him discard his last card, so he has nothing. I know, I know, we're going to take a little damage, but at the end of the day, I think it's worth. What was it, anyway? Worm Bar says, I don't know. I don't know, some of these cards are just out of my my memory, because I didn't, I didn't play the game enough. Oh, there goes that card. Thank God he wasn't our strongest defense monster. What does that do? What, what, what did he just do? No! My Dark Arm Dragon! Good thing I could just summon it next turn, but still. That sucks. Yeah, Mushroom Man, defend us. And I got rid of his card, so he doesn't have a card to summon. Haha, -ha, Spirit... Oh, shit. Not great, but not terrible. If I draw a Wind Monster, it's going to be great. Ah, uh, I didn't draw one. Oh, I can't do it? Is it only once per turn or duel? Okay. Do I not have exactly three in the graveyard? One. Oh, Spirit Reaper. They killed Spirit Reaper. I have four in the graveyard. Shit. Shit. 
One, two, three, four. Yeah. If I can get Dark Sigmorph out of the graveyard, we can do this. We can do this. All right. I'm not going to attack with Mushroom Man because then, you know, he's going to draw a card and we're going to get screwed over. Okay. They have four face downs. I don't know what Ken you can do, but I believe in him. Which is already a good card. You're going to go in Mushroom Man. Okay. Well, at least you have a monster to summon. So it makes a little more sense. You got Griggle. With Michizuri, we're fine. Okay, he's not willing to attack Mushroom Man. That's interesting. I'm going to go ahead and summon Dark Sigmorph. I feel like we're safe with this card on the field. They can no longer set cards, which means they have to... Son of a bitch! Every time. Every time. I think of something and they're ready for it. It was a new trap card they set. That's true. It was a new trap card they set. Oh, really? That's what it does? Damn it. Oh, it's only 300 attack. Wait. What the hell even is that? Oh, shit. That's not good. I don't want to put more dark monsters in the grave, so I didn't put it in. Oh, Sangan's dark. I'm screwed. I'm not going to be able to summon our dark arm dragon. Yeah, we already knew that was coming, but he knew what to do. And he get, he's going to get us a new card. That's the good news. And they ended their turn. I already used Heavy Storm, sadly, so... And I'm not drawing a Wind Monster. I have a lot of Wind Monsters in this deck. Where the heck are they? Alright, Sangan, I trust you because you can get me a Wind Monster if you die. What is that? Is that Terror King Archfiend? Okay, wait a minute. I'm glad it's face up now. What is that? Slip one monster on your field. Your opponent pays the same amount of life. Well, wait a minute. Is it a continuous spell? It is. Okay. Wait a minute. We don't have the... We don't want to be spending no life points, so... Boop. Let them spend the life points. And that's game. I now can draw a wind monster, and that should be it. Wait. Sangan's effect in... I have weak wind monsters in my deck. What happened? What happened? Where's my wind monster? If they tribute a monster, we're... Oh my god. Oh, they didn't tribute. Shit. This is going to be a painful turn. Oh, man. I have to top deck one of my wind monsters or it's over. Destiny draw? That scrap iron. We're screwed. I mean, yep, it's over no matter what. If They, they only have to pay 800. Unless they tribute summon a monster for no reason, which I don't think the enemy AI would do. If they do that, it's over. Oh my god, wait a minute. Wait a minute. That's a tribute monster. Is he going to do it? Holy shit. I think they just cost themselves. That was a horrible play. I think they just lost the duel. Because this will do a thousand damage. Game! We won! <laughs> Holy crap. Freaking Kenyu's trap card comes and saves the day. We should not have won that. The enemy played horribly. Whew. All because I couldn't draw a wind monster. But still. Whoa. Whoa. All right, Kenyu. I think we're ready to do your first story. I think it's time. Yeah, you're not even going to talk to me, are you? Yeah, you don't You don't even talk to me. That was super lucky. Kenyu is going to be the next king of games. So, guys, I think we should all just expect that the story is going to be the same because why would they write multiple stories? Yep, yep. Ignore everything that's happening right now. Guys, we already knew this is what was going to happen. We already knew. Unless you're picking the first tier of characters, that's going to be the same shit. They're not going to spend the time to write a bunch of different stories for people like Ken Yu. You, you, you had to come to that reality. They did make an incredible game, but I still say the beginning of Destiny on PS2 was the best one. Tag Force 1 or Tag Force Evolution. That was my favorite. All right. Now, winning a story mode mission with Ken Yu is going to be tough. This is going to be a tough duel. I don't care what anybody says. Especially when he thinks putting Karate Man in attack mode is a good play. Oh, God. Oh, God, it worked. Never mind. Karate Man attack mode works. Okay. I got Arm Dragon level 5. That's really good. That's really freaking good. Okay, I'm liking this hand. This hand was good. I can win it. I can help win us the duel here. I don't even think you guys have seen my arm dragons yet. Why do we need that? We don't need the blue eyes deck. This deck I made is pretty good. Look at this. Arm dragon level seven already ready to go. And once I lose a dark monster, we get special seven dark Sigmorph. 
Jurassic World, I have 2,800 attack points. Do so you think I'm afraid? Obviously, I'm going to pick this guy. He's just going to die again anyway. I'm expecting a tribute. Alright, what is he going to do? Saversaurus, okay. Well, we were expecting to lose this, but... Ha ha ha! We ain't losing shit. We don't need Dark Sigmorph. We got Ant... Oh, he can't use Antier Giant. We got the Mushroom. Summon Mushroom Man. Damn it. Summon Mushroom Man. I wanted you to attack directly with Mushroom Man. That would have been hilarious. Oh, now you summon Mushroom Man. It's all right, Kenya. We're, we're, we're working good together. Ooh, that's a, bro a broken card. And he's already getting the counters going. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. He could summon Ancient Gear Golem. And I can't... Oh, my God. I can't even use my card to stop him. My Scrap Iron Scarecrow. I need to get rid of all those cards. Oh, wait. I have an effect that does that. Oh, wait. The duel's over. I activate Arm Dragon level 7. I'm going to throw away my Necro Gardener. Blow, blow, blow. Okay. I'm going to activate... Uh, let's see. Are going to summon Mushroom Man? We're going to summon, I would say, Twin Head. Zombie can't attack directly. And we're going to blow up some life points. We have Scrap Iron. We, well, I guess that won't protect us from Crawler, but it will protect us from Hassleberry. There we go. Oh, they're already dead. We had 100 extra. Guys, Mushroom Man wins us the duel. Let it be known. Mushroom Man won us the duel. I thought Tag Force 2 was really fun, but I, I honestly... Tag Force 3, it feels a little bit more... Com mm, no, Tag Force 2 is really good. Tag Force 2 is really good. It's a tough... It's tough. It's tough. Oh no, how could this happen? Mushroom Man wins us the duel. That was so easy, guys. That was so easy. You have no idea. That was easier than when we did it with Atticus or when we did it with Aster Phoenix. That was that easy. That was a joke. Holy crap. King of Shrooms is right. King of Games more like it. Speaking of games, there's a game I want to play. Yeah, you lost to a guy who who intentionally put Mushroom Man in his deck, and in the other game calls himself the Mushroom Man. Kenyu is the next king of games. I don't care what anybody says. That's the truth. I'm glad Dragon and I agree. All right, but is he any good at dodgeball? <laughs> this is more for me. I just like playing dodgeball, but I'm actually really curious to see how it... Because when Kenyu is not our opponent, he's terrible. Okay, this is actually pretty good. There we go, because I can go up here. Get a little angle with only a little bit of power. Boop, boop, boop. There we go. Don't worry, Ken, you all carry us. You carry me in the duels, I'll carry you in the mini games. That's how we'll make this work. Actually, yeah, I could probably just do the exact same angle and shit. Maybe a little more power. Oh, maybe a little too much? Yeah, a little too much. Yeah, exactly. Crawler makes fun of the Slifer Reds. Can you just, like, his eyes light up? Like, oh, you want to lose? You want to die? That's That was your choice. Ah, oh, Kenyu is just like me, right above the head. That was an interesting play by the opponent. That's... Okay, the angle's a little higher. It might work. It might work. Beautiful. Beautiful. Yeah, the more new cards there are, the more confusing it is. That's why I like the begin beginning of Destiny the most. Because all those cards are the ones I know. After beginning of Destiny, even Tap Force 2, the cards get a little complicated. In this game, not so much. I mean, this game, it gets way too complicated. Alright, let's see. And do about... Three pips... Ah, so... Oh, wait a minute! Okay, that's a cooler kill. That's way cooler. Hold up. Okay, that was that was really cool. I should get style points for that one. I should get style points. That was really cool. Oh, that, that sucks. This really sucks. Yeah, I got rid of Bright. Oh, crap. A dodgeball is kind of deadly. Ooh. Okay. Can you move forward and attack? 
Okay, you know what? It's fine. Wait, can you? That might have been a little bit bad. <laughs> and I don't want to move forward, or can you will accidentally kill us both. Or just me. Alright, let's see if that was enough power. Yep, got him. Yeah, there's a lot of cards in this game I have no idea about. Worms, worms are one of the cards I really don't understand. Alright, let's see. Oh, shit. If I move forward, Kenyu will kill me. You know what? I trust Kenyu with my life. I trust him with my life. I better not be killed by him. Oh, so close. That was it's mm, Yeah, terrible throw. Can you? Don't do anything deadly. Okay. I trusted him with my life and he didn't just kill me. So that's a good step in our relationship of non-murder. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I did not want that much power. That was my bad. Hey, who knows? Maybe Ken you can kill him. That was a little bit of a better throw. Might be a little low on power, but the angle was good. Whew, right above my head, can you? Right above my head. Also, you're not very good at dodgeball. I'm starting to notice that, but it's okay. I'm getting good at dodgeball. I'll make up for... Ah, oh, never mind. Forbidden Donut just subscribed. Wait, didn't you already subscribe? Wait a minute. Well, thank you. Either way, I really appreciate it. I didn't... Okay. Welcome back. <laughs> thank you very much for subscribing, Forbidden Donut. I appreciate it. And let's hope that can... Oh, shit. Can you? Are you going to get pied? No, you're not even close. Let's see if Ken you can get a kill on his own. He, so far, he's proven to me he can't, but so close. But he's, he's he's in the mood to make it happen. I keep I try to get a little bit lower than that. I try to get a little bit lower than that. Damn it! I was doing so good earlier, and now I I'm kind of relying on Ken Yu. Hey, we got a gifted sub to Anais. Thank you so much, Graham94, for gifting the sub to An or An Ein Size. That was really nice of you. And Ein Size, well, a welcome to the subscriber party. <laughs> there we go. A little less power this time. Oh, come on! Right on his feet! That was so close. I think now you guys can use those freaking dream clowns and whatnot. Oh, now he has to win the thing. It's all up to Ken Yu. It's all up to Ken Yu. I can't do anything now. It's all up to... Oh my god, I have to trust him. He has not done a single good throw. Hey, we got the dream clowns coming in. <laughs> oh my god, this is like watching two noobs fight in a video game. Like in a fighting game. Like neither of them can even touch each other. They're so bad. That was closer, though. I put the controller down, by the way. I can't do anything right now. Once you get creamed, you're kind of screwed. Oh, God. That might actually hit me. Got a little close, but we're fine. And not enough power, buddy. Not enough power. Am I done being creamed yet? No, I'm going to be creamed forever. Okay. Well, that's, you know, that's the game. Okay, I'm uncreamed now. I can play the... No. No. <laughs> you're not going to cream me again. I want to play the video game. I actually stand a chance of hitting you. Okay, All right, wait, are you going to hit him right after I... Oh, so close, buddy, so close. It's like right after I come back, he just hits him. Nope, nope, no. Nope. Well, actually, that angle might work. Nope, nope, nope. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, it worked. Wait a minute, it worked. All right, took us a while. The turn bonus was horrible. Hit bonus was terrible. But we're in the game now. All right, so they have two health now. I'm going to switch over to rugby ball. Got a big angle on this one. With a decent amount of power. It bounced forwards. We're good. Oh, I got one of them. Ah, crap. Slade's still alive. Can you get rid of Slade for me, buddy? Beautiful. Red Eyes does have a lot of support. But even in this game, uh, Blue Eyes does get a lot of support in this game. You saw me. You gotta mix it a little. You Make sure you use Red Eyes Darkness Dragon in any deck and you'll be fine. It works with the Blue Eyes deck, too. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Ah, damn it. I thought I was going to bounce back. 
Can you, do you want to try and get your first kill? Because you have not killed anybody since we started. Oh, wait. First kill. He did it. Ken, you got his first kill, everybody. Now he's got blood on his hands. And now he wants more. More blood. Actually, we've never had a score this high this early before. This is really good. Usually it takes a little... Oh, shit. That was a bad... That was a bad throw. Please don't bounce back towards us. That was a horrible throw. Well, it's going forward. Ah, it switched directions. Holy shit, Chumley. Can you... Chumley's a madman. He's an animal. All right, it's up to me now. All right, if it's up to me, I'm going to do this for Kenyu. This is revenge. Come on, bounce over that wall they have. No, it went the wrong way. That wall that they have is actually pretty effective. Dodgeball won't kill me at least. Yeah, he's a good throw. Chumley's a damn good throw. Oh crap, that could finish me if two of those hit. Oh, I'm still alive! Oh, I have to get the double kill. Alright, it has to bounce forward into them. Boing, boing, nope, nope. Chumley, can you not throw it? For once, can you throw it bad? That still looks really good. Damn it! Okay, Chumley's too good. We should have had, we should have picked Chumley. Chumley is a damn good dodgeball player. It's all right. Of that entire time, he got one. Ken, you got one kill, and I'm just gonna say that was good enough. Hey, Alvaro, you wanna do a little tag duel with my buddy here? I'm I'm so used to just doing single duels, but ever since Ken, you joined the team, I want to do tag duels all the time. I just wanna I just wanna be with him and have fun. Like if I duel by myself, it's like, eh, sure, I might win, I might lose, but this guy. Can this guy win? Is he going to have stand a chance? That I want to know. All right. Dark Arm Bird and Ken Yu. It was either play... It was either play dodgeball or run the mile. So he decided to play dodgeball. Okay. He's going in. Threatening Roar says you're not. Okay. Well, that sucks for us. I like that you have Amiibo with Creature Swap right now. Well, I don't know about that. I don't know if I'm that into Ken Yu. I mean, he's a nice guy and all, but I'm not into blondes, personally. I guess he's not completely blonde, really. You know, I know he's not blonde. It's like, it's it's kind of light. It's light hair. He has lightish hair. That's the, that's the, the thing. All right, let's go ahead and summon our Snipe Hunter. Activate Snipe Hunter's effect. Don't need you. Goodbye, you. There we go. And I'm going to save my effect for a little bit. Team Kuyu. <laughs> Kuyu. Let's go, Kuyu. We got this. Me and Kenyu could do it. Chum yeah, Kenyu couldn't handle it, but Chumley was plenty willing to kill another person. That's Jirai Gumo. Obviously, they're not going to be willing to attack. Oh, Amoeba Creature Swap. No, Amoeba Creature Swap. Why would you do that? That would have been the best play ever. <sighs> I still love the man, but damn it. He's just not the best duelist in the world. He's got all these crazy plays in his hand. He just doesn't know how to do them. Oh, crap. Don't get double Marauding Cap. Oh, crap. That's worse than double Marauding Captain. All right, Kenyu. You're in charge of my trap cards right now, so you pick the right one. That's the right one. Yes. That was the right one. Arm Dragon level 3 and Arm Dragon level 3. Sadly, I cannot let them get another Marauding Captain, so might have to do a little bit of a a little bit of a dead play right there. What does this card even do? All right, let's find out. Holy shit! It's Cocoon of Evolution. We need Griggle to kill that immediately, or Mushroom Man number two. That's even better. Kill the Cocoon of Evolution before it becomes a problem. Alright, and now I know what you're going to do. Can you win the duel? Can, well, let's ask Kenyu himself. Oh, crap. Is that... That's a problem. That's a problem. A little bit of a... A little bit of an internet drop there, but I think we're good. 2300 direct damage. I think we're good. We have Creature Swap just waiting to... Oh, wait. He's immune to spells, isn't he? Shit. 
Uh, do I have two in the grave? I do have two in the grave! Hell yeah! Boop and... Boop. This is good. Now, they could have a trap card that will ruin my day. Or they won't. <laughs> and if they don't, I'll be happy. Don't ruin my day. My day is ruined. Okay, well, that's fine. We have Scrap Iron, we got Blast... Wait, can't we use Blast Hell by a tribute? Isn't that a thing we can do? It is! Holy crap! Can use... I love this card. I don't know why he uses it, but I love it. Look at how low the opponent's life points are. If he draws Amiibo, we win. Oh, he drew that card again. He could use Creature Swap, and it wasn't face-up, so what was the point? I thought he would do it face-up. Oh, but we got man -ear Bug. That's good. They used Creature Swap. They used it properly. I am so upset right now that they used it properly. Can you... The enemy just showed you how you're supposed to use your monster. Do you understand how embarrassing that is? Oh. Oh, can you? This is bad. We just got kind of... We got styled on right there. We got styled on. The enemy AI was smarter than your AI. Alright, we have two scrap iron, so we'll stop the two dangerous attacks. Alright, if they ever tribute a monster, we can do some damage, but we're in trouble. Um, uh, mine is probably GX as well. GX was the one that I watched the most. Um, even though I watched the regular Yu-Gi-Oh! a lot, it was on Channel 5, whereas GX was on Cartoon Network and Channel 5. So I was able to watch it a lot more. So I watch, I like, I think GX is my favorite by far. Even though the first series, I love it a lot. I, I still watch King, uh, Duelist Kingdom to this day. And I still watch Battle City to this day. The problem with Battle City, though, it gets kind of slow. So it's not the best. But I still watch it, is what I'm trying to say. Yeah, if, if Kenyu had all this blue AI, his deck might actually be considered good. But since he doesn't have all this blue AI, he makes these very simple mistakes. And he doesn't take advantage of everything he has. But at the same time, that's why I'm here. I'm, I'm here to clean it up a little bit. If I can just draw a dark monster, I can get my my bird back and we'll be fine. Oh, there we go. We're, we'll heal a little bit. Arc 5 is the most disappointing? I would not know. I, I didn't even watch 5Ds for crying out loud. And I heard 5Ds was great. I just didn't watch it because by that point I was already in freaking... What? Oh, oh, it was late high school, almost going to college, so I just wasn't that into it. And by that point, I was getting more into Pokemon than Yu-Gi-Oh. I still kind of am in, in more into Pokemon than Yu-Gi-Oh, but the only reason why I don't play Pokemon as much is because I really love to, you know... Uh, you know, I, I don't like to play Pokemon unless it's with my friends. That's the problem. I drew a Dark Monster, by the way, so we're back in the game. I just gotta hope they don't have a Trap Card to stop us, because if they do, I'm gonna be really sad. They did it last time with Mirror Force. They can't Mirror Force us twice. But then they did this, and it's over. Exile Force is going to kill my freaking bird. Ah, damn it. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, no, I thought it was Tribute Summoning. Damn it. Tribute Summon a monster already. My favorite Pokemon is Pidgeot. My favorite type... Ah. My favorite Pokemon is Pidgeot by far, but my favorite type is a really hard one to, 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 to decide on. It could be Grass, it could be Poison. Grass or Poison is up there. But P Pidgeot was my first ever Pokemon. Uh, for some reason, when I first got Leaf Green as, as a kid, my, my game was glitched. Oh, Giant Trunade, they win. Uh, my, ga my game was glitched and I didn't end up getting a starter Pokemon. I have no idea why I walked into the first glass and I got a Pidgey. It just automatically gave me a Pidgey. So, I, Pidgeot was my actual starter and I used it and it was my favorite Pokemon. Uh, favorite Ash Companion? I would say... <sighs> That's a tough one. I would say May. I really liked May. I think May was fun. Oh, Sobble? Nice. Sobble's a cool favorite Pokemon. Yeah, I like Sobble too. All right, don't worry, Kenyu. We're gonna we're gonna get you some good. We're gonna get you some wins. It's it's about time I I do some single duels though. I've been doing tag duels all day. Let me get a little break. Iris was fun. I I, I liked her energy. 
uh, her story with her with the Dragonite and everything was kind of cool. It's not uh, not my favorite partner, but she was cool. Eh, Dawn, I thought was really cool. I thought she I thought she was like really well uh, uh, well uh, fleshed out, but she wasn't really that good at battling. She was more about the Pokemon contest, and I wasn't that into that. I was more about the battling, and uh, Ma uh, I know May was the exact same thing with the Pokemon contest, but she was really good at battling. Uh, when it came to battles, she was way more interesting. I loved her Blaziken. Blaziken was way cooler than, like, Piplup. Dragalge's fun. Yeah, Dragalge's a fun type. I mean, Dragalge's a fun uh, Pokemon. I would not make Cynthia his companion. I do not want to watch a story where Ash is being followed around by a... 20 to 30 year old woman. I feel like that's no. That's a no. Pokemon tag battles are definitely still a thing. Yeah. They even added triple battles in black and white, but they had to take those out because they got lazy. And yes, that's what I'm going to say. Even if it's not the truth, screw them. I'm upset. I thought triple battles were fun. All right, Disa, let's see how you do against my deck. No can you this time. It's just going to be me trying my best. I want to show you what my deck can do. Interesting. I have not watched the recent Pokemon anime, no. Not that I not that I wouldn't like it, I just I just haven't watched it. I watched a, I watched some Digimon in my time too. Yeah, I like Digimon. Alright, first things first, let's flip Slate Warrior so it's buffed. It gets 2400 attack points. I'm just gonna summon Mr. Necro Gardner. And we're gonna go in. I actually did make a Digimon fan game. I have a Digimon fan game, guys. It's called Digi Destinies, and it's up on Itch.io. I, I I don't know if you guys were around during my YouTube uh, my er earlier YouTube days when I made the game, and I've actually been making an update to for it recently. I had to slow down on the update, but I have been making an update for it. But I made a I made a, I've made a fan Digimon game. It's called Digi Destinies. Brock was probably the best companion. Yeah, I don't even know why I, I'm even questioning that. Brock was probably the best companion. Alright, so we both got 2400 and you just did that, so let me draw cards. Okay. You're an interesting gal, I'll give you that. Set this, I'll activate it later. Uh, it's all good though, I don't need to activate it now. I'm just gonna summon Zombira. I don't know how to send a link in the chat, but it's not a good it's not a well-made game. I'm gonna tell you right now, it's not a well-made game. It's like it's like made with HTML. Like, it's not good. It's just, uh, it's just like a pick a path and see what Digimon you end up with. And sometimes you don't even get that. But, uh, I, if you, if you go on my, if, I, I could send, I guess I can get a link for it later. But I, I don't have it right here. But yeah, I, I've made a Digimon fan game. It's called Digi Destinies. I, I, yeah, I'll find a, I don't know how to put a link in the chat, honestly. Not while I'm streaming. Like, I, I don't know how to make that work. Alright, let me go ahead and use Mystical Space Typhoon. Boop, boop, boop. Alright. Then we're gonna attack. Ah, Spirit Reaper, you dick. Now, at least Anti-Spell Fragrance makes me a little bit safer. Uh-oh. Oh, Monarch. That's not good. Uh, you know what? No, I don't want Necro Gardner to leave the graveyard because I want to get Dark Arm Dragon. Okay, I need Zombira to die to get Dark Arm Dragon. Once Zombira is dead, we can get Dark Arm Dragon, and then we can really start. Because Dark Arm Dragon is going to win us the duel. She is an obelisk blue student, so I have to... And she's using the Monarchs, all of them, for crying out loud. So I have to play this smart. You know what? That's fine. That's fine. Uh, yes, I would like to draw a card. And for some reason, you're using that. Oh god, that, that's not good. If he throws away another Dark Mon- Oh, it wasn't Dark, we're fine. That could have been bad. Uh, no, we, we need this many in the grave. Holy crap, that was- She summoned three Monarchs in one turn. She is on another level of Duelist. I gotta give it to her. Alright. 
You found my game? How did you find my game? <laughs> you think it'd be really hard to find. Alright, let's see. I'm gonna go ahead and just start throwing away cards. Boop. What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Freak out. And then I'm gonna do it again. Yeah, I don't think I allow links in chat just in case we get any uh, bots or bad people. So like I said, I don't think I could post a link for you guys. I'm sorry. I don't think it's allowed. I don't want to... Even... I don't, I don't want to risk it. Obviously, you're not going to do anything, but like... I don't want to turn it off for a second and then a bot gets in here and puts a link to something really bad. That would be... That would be really bad on for me. And for everybody at home. Alright, let's see. Oh yeah, the Discord server, you could probably definitely post it. Read my Pokemon fan game comment. The only reason I haven't read them is because they're super long and I'm kind of focused in the battle. Let me... How do I scroll up on this thing? Alright, let's see. I'm a poet fan idea. You're essentially going to be a very leader of E4. At certain intervals, like you beat Brock, you take first gym. You beat... Uh, you do gym defenses, then you challenge Misty. Yeah, that'd be cool, moving up in the ranks. I like that idea. I always thought it was weird. That's kind of... Like, that That, that works. The only reason I, I don't think... Uh, like, I would understand it is simply because, like, the gym leaders don't have ranks. Like, even if it's like, oh, you're the first gym, you're the 8th gym, they all are at actually the 8th, 1st, 2nd gym. It just depends on when the people show up to their place. So, like, you know. Ah, Threatening Roar, damn. Because, you know, uh, freaking, what's her name? Uh, shit. Um, in the, in the anime, it shows you that, like, if a, if a, a person comes in sh with 7 gym badges, they have a different set of Pokemon they use, but if they come with two gym badges, they have a different set of Pokemon they use. It actually depends on when the person shows up and how many badges they happen to have at that point. But you're, I mean, obviously it's a fan game idea. It could be anything, so that works. That'd be fun. To be like, oh yeah, you just go up in the ranks. You become second gym, eighth gym, elite four, elite four, elite four champion. Alright, there we go. And, ooh, we're already getting that second heart up. I love it. Ken, you loves it when I win a duel, I'll tell you that much. That was a little bit close, though. That girl summoned three monarchs, and we somehow survived. That was closer than I wanted it to be. Let's go to the raw yellow dorm. All right, here. Let me, uh, let me buy a, let me buy a variant card. Just one, just one. Yeah, just one. From Lottery A. We got the XYZ Dragon Cannon. Hell yeah. You gotta love it. It's cool. Alright. And then let's go ahead and do a duel. And let's do a tag duel. I mean, yeah. Technically, she's supposed to be the fifth gym uh, in Leaf Green. But if, in all honesty, after you fight, like... After you fight Misty, you can fight the gyms in, like, any order you want. Except for the 8th gym. The 8th gym is always the 8th gym. But, like, you could fight all the gyms, like, in a, in a weird order if you wanted to. Because you don't need to fight Surge, because all he does is give you fly. And, or, or give you the ability to fly, which you don't need. Um, I don't even think any of the other ones are that important. Because you don't need Surf or anything to fight uh, the Poison gym. You only need it to fight the 7th gym, so that's the one where you have to have a certain order. Alright, he set his Mushroom Man, which I kind of appreciate, especially since he's going to get rid of the Great Rat. That's pretty good. I like that rune. I like that a lot. Alright, sadly, I don't have any cards in my hand that can stop them at the moment. Um, I'm going to use Armageddon Knight, because actually I have a... I, oh god, I have a better idea. Holy crap. Wait a minute. This is, this is a really good hand now. I didn't realize I had Armageddon Knight, because now I can just do this. Activate this card's effect. All right, then boop, and boop. And look at that, we summoned our Dark Sigmorph first turn. Now, do they have two trap cards on the field? Yeah, but I feel safe, we're fine, we're fine. No no worry, no way they have Mirror Force. There we go. Have you looked, played a Pokemon Academy life? I've never heard of Pokemon Academy life, never. 
I don't really, I haven't really played many fan games. I played the Star vs. the Forces of Evil fan game. I did that one on the channel, but I haven't really played many fan games. That's just the, that's just the fact of, the fact of it. All right, use Griggle. Oh, you're going to use Anti-Air Giant. Well, as long as you actually use it. Oh, you don't want to use it for battle? Never mind. That was a bad play. Oh, God, you're giving them Anteater Giant for some reason. Why? Why would you do that even for a second? You haven't even... You didn't even normal summon. Exactly. Why did you do this? We could have won that turn. All right, it's fine. Even though they have no Momomonga and that's going to waste a lot of time, it's fine. All right, Zombira's going to help, though. Zombira's definitely going to help. Now, Anteater Giant, I want you to actually attack because we know they don't have any trap cards that can stop us. All right, so this is what we're going to do. Zombira is going to do the damage. Yes, they're going to heal 100 life. Or, no, they're actually going to take 100 damage. They're going to heal 2,000 life points, and I'm going to do 4,700 They have nothing to special summon? Never mind, we won the duel. All right, and I'll let uh, I'll let his Anteater Giant do the, do the honors. Can you? Sometimes you're a great partner. I want you to know that. But other times you just don't like to do your deck strategies. And doing your deck strategies is important. Alright. Wow, it's really easy to get his hearts up. Like, whenever he wins a duel, he's so surprised that he's just like, Yeah, I love you. I've never even heard of Academy Life. Like, is that an official game or is it just a fan game? Uh, there's a Wait, there is a Pokemon fan game I did play. It was like a tower defense game. Not on the channel. I played it for fun. Um... I don't remember what it was called, but it was like a tower defense Pokemon game, and I really liked it because you could get Pidgey really early. All right, Shien Spy with Griggle already. Reign of Mercy, tremendous. Or no, Final Flame is nice. Do you want to use? Uh... If I let Ken you duel on his own, we're in trouble. However, we already did that with Chumley, and we saw what happened there. It was not a not a good result. And I guess I shouldn't just judge by results. However, I'm going to. Because I'm not the nicest guy in the world. Alright, can you? I'm going to get... Ah, uh... oh, shit. Ah, oh, Nightmare Wheel? I hate that card. That's a brutal card to use on us. This guy really is a burn deck user. Look at this. 800 damage already. Luminous Slime. Ah, shit. Sacred Crane, yeah, that sucks. Um, I'm going to activate this. Oh, you used my anti-spell fragrance when you really shouldn't have. Uh, I should blame myself on that one, but I really just wish you didn't. Yeah, I know we take 800 damage, but if we lose everything, then, or we lose our one monster stopping them from getting direct attacks, then we're in trouble. And he agrees with me. Plus, I want to use it as a tribute if I draw my better card. Might be a little hard to make it happen, but screw it. Well, that's a card. I, I summon Snipe Hunter. Gonna activate Snipe Hunter's effect. Get rid of a Troop Dragon. First things first, I want my monster back. Good. Second things second, I want... Get rid of your field spell. Perfect. And finally, I want to get rid of the one thing that could actually stop me right now. Which is you. And it was... Just damage. We're fine. And now we're coming back. Could have used Premature Burial. I just realized that. Damn it. What a waste. Okay, get rid of Sacred Crane. And just in case they're rolling with flip effects, I'm going to go right here. Yeah, yeah, you still get hearts if you duel alone. You definitely do. I, I, I When I dueled, I just recently dueled alone and I got a heart for it. Oh boy, is this a boss monster? That's definitely a boss monster. And you get to draw a card, yep. I remember Sacred Crane's effect. Sadly, no. That one I might... You know what? No. Actually, no. Because we have Premature Burial. And we want him to be weakened. And then after... Then we can Premature Burial and win. 
Boom. He's doing it. He's doing it, guys. This is perfect. Wait. Oh, I forgot that card stops it. Oh, well, we're screwed. Okay, well, we are screwed. Scrap Iron Scarecrow can't protect us forever. Oh, nothing's going to protect us anymore. The hell is that? Oh, Mushroom Man. All right, we're still in this duel. I just don't know how to come back. Unless I top deck my Dark Sigmorph. But I don't know if I, that's that's a hell of a top deck. Zombira, that actually counts as a hell of a top deck. As long as I don't attack, we're fine. Although if I do it, I kind of have to attack. I have to attack, I have to attack. Because then he could just attack me instead. He'll just suicide play. He might still do it, but screw it. Yeah, I had I had to do it. It was a it was a lose lose situation. He was just gonna attack me on his turn and make it happen. All right, Wandering Spirit, go. God, you love that card. Eh, Turtle Boy's gonna win this one. If you guys want, I can go find somebody for Ken Yu to fight by himself, but I'm just saying that's a little risky. Ken Yu's, Ken Yu's a little, little, little problematic on his own. He's a little scary. Like, he's not very good. But if you really want me to, I can go find him a person. Let's go, let's go take a look around. Oh, <laughs> no. I just look at those guys, I'm just like, no, you're not, you're not the one I'm gonna make Ken you fight. Alright, let's see, where haven't we been? Those are two fights he's guaranteed, two fights he's guaranteed to lose. I want him to have a fighting chance. If I'm gonna make Ken you fight somebody against his will, he, he, he needs to have a fighting chance. Go to the dual field. This would be an interesting one. Hold up. This might be interesting. I'm gonna put the I'm gonna put the controller down because you guys wanted to see can you do a duel? I'm gonna show I'm gonna tell you right now, he stands almost no chance of winning. But why not? Give him a shot. Bondas were usually really nice to the Slifer Reds. Anyone that's a dropout, she's super nice to. She even raises the rank for them. So let's see what my uh, my buddy here can do. We got 600. He's got the Griggle Shien Spy combo he's not going to use. Oh, he didn't set Michizure. That's a really bad play on his part. He probably should have set Michizure. Oh, she didn't do anything. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, this is good. Oh god, don't use your spell card. Oh, instant gift card combo. Instant gift card combo, holy crap. That sucks. Oh god, when your opponent summons a monster, no, that sucks. He can't even summon a monster anymore. Without taking damage. I don't know if he runs Heavy Storm, guys, so this is gonna be a weird one. More Michizuras. Yes, you need it. Set it. Coward. <laughs> Where's all your monsters, can you? She's not willing to attack you, which I find hilarious. And you've drawn none of your monsters. You've drawn terrible cards. You have terrible cards. I wish I could edit your deck, but we need to get you a little bit above two hearts. Once you pass two hearts, you can edit your partner's deck. And he took a thousand damage by upstart. Damn it. Oh, she is going in. Uh, I didn't, I wasn't able to make the moth deck because I only had one cocoon of evolution. I tur it turns out I only had one cocoon of evolution. I need to get more cocoon of evolution first. Which, hey, we might get that today. That would be great. Hey, Amoeba, you can still do Amoeba. Oh god, you're hurting yourself. Whatever you do, don't don't Shen Spy Griggle. If you Shen Spy Griggle, you lose the duel. Okay, you chose Amoeba. That was a good play. That was a good play. You at least did one good play. Wall of Rebellion Light. <laughs> Holy crap. You know what? You got her points pretty low, buddy. I, I gotta I gotta appreciate that. She has pretty low life points. 
Yeah, I wanted to make the perfect ultimate great moth deck. I wasn't able to because it was it was too many. I, I mean, it was, I didn't. I only had one cocoon of evolution. It would be really hard and really boring for me to just wait for it. Oh, he drew Mother Grizzly. That's like his best card. And he put it in defense. Oh, I guess he had to. He summons Mother Grizzly. He dies. Bastion is definitely depressed. Yeah, there's no question about it. And he, he kind of deserves to be. He sucks. All right, what do we got? Mask of Darkness instantly. All right, so I don't think he runs Heavy Storm. I don't see how Kenyu comes back. I guess Creature Swap would work. I haven't been able to make a hero deck, no. I have not made a hero deck. It's hard to get the original Elemental Heroes, and I don't know the new ones at all. He technically could summon Mushroom Man, but I guess he won't. And she's not willing to go in against him. That's the interesting part. Uh, Bastion. Even though I hate Cyrus with, like, a bloody passion, Bastion's probably the worst. Chumley, I don't even hate that much. He's the chumpster. I like him. It's Ch it's Bastion who's the problem. And Cyrus is definitely a problem, but I, I respect that he got better, whereas Bastion just got worse. Bastion started off okay and got worse. They are not willing to finish each other off, even though she could probably win the duel right now if she wanted to. Maybe he can win by deck out? The the difference with the difference with, Oh god, did he just kill himself? He's at 25 life points. Have you ever seen anybody at this low life points before? Okay, with the Michizuri, he got rid of another card. It was Marshmallow on, thank God. He's at 25 life points. I have never seen a person this low. Yeah, but Ch I mean... Uh, what is it? Uh, Jaden liked Chaz, though. Jaden didn't even hate on Chaz. Fair enough, Merrick did get one. And that's game, Upstart Goblin. Shit. Sorry, I, uh, sorry, man. I didn't want you to do alone, but the fans, they wanted to see you. They wanted to see you do alone. I couldn't help it. Here, I'll, I'll duel with you on this one. Chaz is my favorite character. I'm glad you like Chaz as well. Chaz is my favorite character. He's the one who grew the most. He, had the, he was the one that grew the most. All right, let's see what we got here. Dark on Bird versus Yan and Shannon. I have not even seen Atticus. I have not seen Atticus even once. Although I think we're going to see him in the story mode, that's for sure. Since, you know, the story is exactly the son of a bitch. Oh wait, it's Quagar Hercules. I like this guy. Alright. Ooh, that's a good freaking hand. Just so he doesn't have Michizuri now. Alright, but he will get Amoeba, and he has Shen Spy in his hand. He just won't be able to use it. But if I get Creature Swap, it'll be fine. Alright, let's see what we got. We got Spirit Re Reaper. I like that. We got seven tools. We got Magic Cylinder. And... Let's see. Any of these I'm going to activate? I might activate Magic Cylinder in time. There we go. And I'm going to end my face. Hey, good on you, Tachyon X. That's freaking hard to do. That's a lot of work. And they got Heavy Storm. Very good. Slifer Reds with Heavy Storm. One of my biggest spears. Gel and Duo with Sanctuary in the Sky. I ha luckily have Heavy Storm, so we're fine. But still another big fear of mine. Whatever you do, do not Shien spy my monster. Use it on your own amoeba. Use it on your own amoeba. Alright, let's see. What do we got here? Who do we got? Mushroom Man's dead. We can live with that fact. It's a sad fact, but a true one. We just need to wait till I get one of my bigger monsters. We're safe right now. 
We're safe right now for now. Oh, actually, I drew one of my bigger monsters, so let me just do this. There we go. Gonna kill two monsters in one go with this guy, just in case shit hits the fan. Probably should use swords first, honestly, but whatever. And this should kill two monsters. There we go. That's why you use Heavy Storm. Alright, what are you gonna do now? Warrior of Zera. Interesting. I wonder what that card is. I wonder if it's Warrior of Zera. Now use Amoeba with Shien Spy. Do it for me. Summon your Amoeba, use Shien Spy. Yeah, no, I I 100%... Did you use it on my Slate Warrior? Did you just use that Shien Spy on my Slate Warrior, you, you dumb, dumb person? Why would you do this to us? Damn it. Yeah, no, 400 hours sounds about right. And I I also struggled on the tournaments. In this game, though, I've actually done all the tournaments except one. In this game, I, I only have one left. Alright, this is good. This is good. Arm Dragon is always a good card to draw. Now, do they have a trap card on the field? Yes, but I have Spirit Reaper as an emergency. In case of emergency, so we're fine. And we know this is Warrior of Zera, so... No! Why did you auto-target that one? I wanted Warrior of Zera. Dang it. Well, you know what? It's fine. We're gonna get Arm Dragon level 7. Arm Dragon level 7, be born. And with this, we don't stand a chance of losing. Ooh, Swords of Concealing Light. Luckily, I have Swords of Revealing Light, but it's gonna run out, so we are about to lose everything. Karate Man, save our lives. Save our skin. Y yeah, that's not great. You just gave them more stuff. Oh, this sucks. This sucks. This just sucks. Oh, that's even worse. Oh my god, we just lost everything. Except Spirit Reaper, right? Yeah, except Spirit Reaper. But the fact that... Oh, Swords of Concealing Light. What a great card. What a great card. Uh, just the challenge tournament. Just the just the final tournament. That's it. Alright, Scrap Iron Scarecrow was an amazing draw. We're still in this duel thanks to that draw. Because that Saber thing is going to be a problem. Anytime Saber attacks, I'm going to use Scrap Iron Scarecrow. Isn't it true that you can't get all the cards through uh, the packs, though? Don't you have to get some of the cards through some, like, Reckon... Oh, that might be Tab Force 2. Never mind. Never mind. We're cool. It was, like, some recognition thing. But, yeah, that's obviously you need... That's from the older game to the newer game, so that's different. Why would you use that a card? Why would you do this? Why did you use my Necro Gardener? Okay, technically, he didn't do anything to us that turn. If I... No, no, it's worth it if I draw a monster. I did not draw a monster. It was not worth it. Alright. Just scrap iron the big boy and we'll figure it out from there. Pandemonium. With Warrior of Zera, that's scary. Depends on what Duel Academy you're playing. Damon is awful in the beginning of Destiny, but he's pretty good in the other ones. Including this game. He's alright. He's alright. Mushroom Man, of course. That's the safest card we can think of. We have enough monsters now. I just need to draw top deck a good card. Once I top deck a good card, I can win us this duel. But beginning at Destiny is my favorite game. Oh. Oh, well, that's not going to work. I think we have like a million dark monsters in the graveyard. One. Or maybe None. Never mind, we lost a lot of cards, but they were not dark. Just one. We only have one dark monster in the graveyard right now. Alright, we're gonna have to work on that. Yeah, good luck getting all the cards. Okay, just gonna use Scrap Iron. I know Ken is just gonna use my Necro Guard now, which is gonna suck, because I don't want him in the graveyard. I don't want him removed from play. I want him in the graveyard. So I could summon my Dark Arm Dragon eventually, but I know he's not going to do it. He's going to be a jerk about it. Yep, he just did it already. Thank you for thank you for doing that. You wasted my turn and yours. There's no reason to protect that monster. 
Except from the Saber Beetle, which we already have a plan for that. Damn it, where are all my cards? Alright, there we go. As long as I have Scrap Iron Scarecrow, we're safe. I just need to get three Dark Monsters in the graveyard. And I can't, because I haven't drawn any. Antier Giant is going to kill us. He just killed us. Oh my god, can you? Learn to play Yu-Gi-Oh! for the crying out loud. Dang it. Don't you know that we need we needed Scrap Iron Scarecrow? Now we're going to lose by piercing damage. I, the only chance we have now is if I dark, dark, uh, draw Dark Sigmorph. That's the only chance. I have to draw it. I drew... You know what? That's interesting too. That might help. That might help. We're going to have to take this piercing damage. But if he can summon a monster and activate my, my Torrental Tribute, we're good. He's not going to summon a monster, is he? I just realized he's not going to do it. Because I can't do it because I'm not going to get a turn. So, unless they summon a monster, which I highly doubt... Okay. Still in the duel? There! Do it! Alright. We can't lose by piercing damage anymore, but we have nothing and I have to top deck something. Oh, that's kind of nice. At least it's something that I can, like, just go like, hey, you can't beat us. We should be okay, guys. We should be okay. Oh, it's over. Freaking Sliper Reds with that card. Brutal. Brutal. Eh, I'll take this loss in strides. We're fine. It just means we should change our deck again. And I have a fun deck that's coming up right now. So we're going to change our deck again, guys. I got to have some fun with that deck. We got a lot of good wins. Probably would have had a lot more if I was doing single duels, but we, it's okay. Oh, what? That's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to go to the deck menu. Our goal for today is to try and edit his deck. So we need to get to his second heart. So let's go to deck recipes. We're going to load a new deck in. Oh my god, we made so many of these. Look at this. Woo! Okay. We're going to Clowny Daggers, y'all. So this deck is terrible. But I think it'll be fun. And I want you all to enjoy it. If you can't enjoy it, I understand. I did not want to do that. That was on accident. Alright, so let's see. We got a raw yellow here. Let me try. I'm going to try and duel Daron with my new deck just to show you guys what it's about. Uh, I don't know if it's any good. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. I need to I need to give uh, Ken Yu a break. I've been dueling with him for too long. It's time for me to take over. Like this whole day, this whole day has been tag duels. So Clowny Daggers is our new deck. There we go. Nice. I already like my hand. I, I like my hand a lot. This is good. Okay, set you, set you, set you, safe fairy box in case they have a card to kill it. Uh, Spirit Korean's useless at the moment, so I'm just going to summon Injection Fairy Lily. There we go. Okay, we're going to go ahead and activate our Solemn Wishes. If you're wondering what this deck does, I don't know either. We'll figure that out together. It does work, that's all I know. Okay, we're going to draw a card. Hey, look at this, guys. Look who we drew. We got Bastion's card. Uh, let's go ahead and do some damage. You attack that stray lamb. Nope. Oh, it's Wabaku. And damn it. And damn it. A uh, uh, good guess. I uh, Yeah, these would be good with Sacred Beast, but since I don't have Yuria, no, I don't. It's It's not happening. I apologize if I got your hopes up. Well, that's not good. I'm going to go ahead and activate this card. Pay 3,000 life points, because with my card on the field, they're never going to get above 3,000. And it doesn't matter that I pay 3,000, because I'm about to heal. There we go. Okay, let's go ahead and set you. Set you. And let's start playing the game like we're supposed to. Attack. You attack that one. Activate my effect. Better not have Draining Shield or Wabaku. There we go. And don't worry, guys. We'll heal next turn, so we're fine. And he did have Wabaku the whole time. He thought I was going to kill myself. That's why. Okay. The AI was too dumb. It didn't understand. We're, we're in the clear. And we'll just keep healing so I can use Injection Fairy Lily infinitely. 
But this is a clown deck, don't worry. It just has a lot of support. There we go, there's my favorite card. I know I'm not counting Black Skull Dragon, but come on. This is, this is the boy. This is the boy. Since Tag Force 2, he's been the boy. He's always helped us out. Hey, we got the Dream Clown emo coming up. That's right. That is correct. Alright, you attack this Stray Lambs. I don't want to use your effect right now. Haha, <laughs> we got multiple Dream Clowns in the chat now. There we go. And just to check it out. Oh wow, we actually could kill it. Surprised. Daron, I don't think you're going to be able to beat my deck. You're, you're really struggling for a raw yellow. That girl is a problem. I will give you that much credit. She is a problem. But I, I think we're fine. Oh, I got both my clowns. They're screwed. They're absolutely screwed. Alright, well. Let's see. If I do a flip effect, he gets another card back. Let's not do a flip effect. Let's not let her have her effect either. There we go. And let's see if we could just go in right now. Shit! I was hoping it would just be a card I could beat, but I'm willing to pay the life points because I have so many life points. Guys, look at this deck. Look at this deck. The clowns are coming out. The Injection Fairy Lily strong. We got this. We already got Haman. We need Intermediate Trust to fight. Yeah. I know what we need to find Yuria. We just haven't gotten lucky. We've been trying multiple times, you know. And we can't get Raviel because we didn't get that pack. We don't have that pack. Stray Lambs again? Oh my god, this guy's just... Lo he loves wasting our time. He just loves wasting it. I would flip my Spirit Creed in, but why? Axe of Despair! I love this card. Let me get a big heal. I actually should change my challenge to the healing challenge, now that I think about it. Uh, I'm gonna not play Axe of Despair right now, just because I don't want to fill up my zone. Alright, let's go in. Injection Fair Lily, I might need you, sadly, so don't, don't even think about it. Dream Clown, you can handle this one. No, not that one! I wanted the other one! Dang it! Every time! Every time the controller just does that to me. Well, that was a waste of life points and a turn. Since you were five? Oh god, you, you are young, you're a young viewer, man. I've had the beginning of Destiny for a long time now. Since I was... Oh, actually, I'm not that much older than you, if you were five when you got it. Let me put things in perspective. I was five years old when I got Digimon World 3. And that's when it came out. That's that's the that's the age right there. All right, so we should be good. This should just be a little bit of pop and drop. We win the duel. So this is our new deck, everybody. I hope you enjoy it. I think it's a fun one. It it it, it, it I feel like we got a good hand, but it, it should work. It should work. If I need to partner with you, Bell, that's on uh, that's on you guys. I, I don't choose my partners. You guys choose my partners. Remember that. I, I'm not the one who chooses my partners. So if you guys want me to get if you guys want me to get that pack, you have to pick you bell for the next time we get a partner. Huh, we're not going to class. Come on. Come on, you crazy kid. You think we're actually gonna go learn something? I ain't gonna let you learn. Alright, let's go see what we can collect. Oh yeah, oh look, some people are ditching- Why is a teacher ditching a class with Daron? I was just seeing if anyone- You guys are ditching class too, wow. You know what, Tyranna is probably a better example. How how do I do against him with my new deck? I didn't think Yubel was scary. I thought it was she was just weird. Because, it, it, you know, she was so, like, obsessive. Alright, let's see if Clowny Daggers can take on a real opponent. Tyrannal Hasselberry. That would be hilarious if Crowler doesn't let you skip class. You better be joking that, about that. Because that would be hilarious if he actually just doesn't let you. Alright, Jinzo Returner. Gonna end, our, end my turn. I got one of my clowns, but I got it a little too early. That's true. I never even considered that. What if Would Crowler just say you're not allowed to? Duels of the Roses, I also have that game. I love that game. I'm doing a Let's Play of it right now. Uh, I have Forbidden Memories. I also have Castle Monster Coliseum, Tap Force 1 and 2, World Championships. I got them as well. You and me are very sim uh, similar, Tachyon. You and me are very similar. Alright. Uh, right now, I'm just going to summon Uguchi. I'm going to summon my Jinzo Returner. 
And I'm gonna go in for a little bit of poke damage. Nothing big, just a little tap tap. A little tap tap, nothing big. There we go. He doesn't let you skip in Tag Force 2? I did not know that. I did not know that. I, I feel so bad for you. Oh my god, that sucks. That really sucks. Wait, I, I partnered with him before. I wonder how that... Did I just put up with class? It's possible. Alright. Oh, this duel is over, guys. Look at this. Look at this play I'm about to do. It's freaking crazy. Boop. He has to be in attack mode now. And then I'm going to activate the Axe of Despair. I'm going to give it to my Jinzo Returner. And the duel is over. Clown attacks directly. This counts as a direct attack. Come on. Uh, everyone's just going to attack directly. Yep. That, that was that was intentional that the names of the people have the are, are depending on their decks. It's it's the gimmick. Oh yeah, that's true. I love the ancient gear monsters. They're so much fun. I agree with you, Graham. It's it's definitely worth it. The best thing about Crowler is that he uses ancient gears. That's the coolest thing there is. All right, Dream Clown. Let's go ahead and just attack. Get a little direct damage in. I don't think he gives you any free cards unless like it's after a test or something. Yeah, even if he is your partner, I don't know. All right, I'm going to go ahead and end my turn. And let's see what they do. Oh, Tribute Summon. Oh, oh, oh no. What does this do again? Oh, that's fine. That's, that's not even that bad. Sure, we'll lose uh, our Axe of Despair, but, and Dream Clown's screwed now. But it's cool. It's, it's absolutely cool. I'll get my Axe of Despair back right now. Okay, so that Triceratops thing, that does intimidate me a little bit, I will admit. Uh, yeah, I'll pay 500, I don't care. But at the same time, I'm just gonna try and burn him down before it matters. Oh, Dark Worlds are an amazing deck. My friend Vidal uses them in real life. Like, they're just insanely good. It's literally like you don't even get to let your opponent play the game. Alright, and then we'll do 300 damage directly. And now the whole duel is up to Fairy Box, everybody. The whole duel is up to Fairy Box. Whether we win or lose depends on the Fairy Box. Oh, boy. Yeah, no, he's one of my favorite cards because he's immune to spell and traps. He's not willing to attack us. He's too afraid of Fairy Box. We win the duel. It's over, guys. It's over. The poor fool. He, he was too afraid to make a move. Our deck has broken the AI. We attack directly with Jinzo Returner. That's game. Either that or the name. Yeah, it, second coin toss would help, but it would also slow me down a little bit. I just gotta trust it. Oh, two Nature Gear Golem's fun. Yeah, that's a fun card. Uh, we're almost back at 5,000 DP. I gotta consider. Silver and gold in your hand? I know, it's insane. You can't lose. Dark worlds are crazy. Alright, let's see. I'm gonna go... Oh, I can't go to the classroom. No one's in class. Got it. We're gonna go to the classroom. Because I, I think that's a place we don't usually visit. Let's go visit the classroom. See if we can find some students. That are willing to duel us. Maybe give Ken Yu some more time in the sun. Depending on the opponents. We got Vyga and Walter. We got Bonji and uh, Deloge. Look at all these mixed groups. We got Ray and Enzo. Nathan and Lily. I might, I might fight some of these guys right here. Why not? We need to get our hearts up. And you know what? I need to do some tag duels because that gets our hearts up faster. All right, let's duel Ray. Give me a, give me a break here. Let's see how we do, everybody. Now, this is my first time using a tag duel with this deck. I don't know if it's going to be effective. I mean, we destroyed Tyranno Hassleberry. But Ken Yu has not worked with my deck before, so we don't know. We don't know. Ooh, he's got a Giant Rat already. I like that. Giant Rat works well with my deck, too. So if his Giant Rat survives, I can use it. Let's see what Ray's going to do. Swords? That's really quick. Sucks that they had swords this early. Unless I draw Heavy Storm, which I did not. 
All right, I'm going to go ahead and summon Dream Clown. I'm going to activate Heart of Clear Water on my Dream Clown. Yep, yep, just to being a dick. He's being a dick, everybody. And we're going to end turn. We're go probably going to lose our Dream Clown now. And that's why we run Spirit Creedon. Spell Absorption. Ah, Enzo, I don't like. Ooh, I don't like Enzo. I really don't like Enzo. We need to kill that card. Karate Man, tr Giant Rat, I don't care. Just kill that card. Swords, yeah, I know. Swords is on the field. We'll deal with it in a second, but... Did he just sacrifice Karate Man? Giant Trunade. Ah, oh, gi Giant Trunade. He's going to play Swords again. Holy shit. What is this? Ally of Justice, whatever its name is. This is bad. This is bad. This is not going the way I had wanted it to go. I'm going to summon Muka Muka. We're just going to take the risk of... Oh, shit. I forgot. Yeah. I forgot he tribute summoned. I don't know why I thought it was still the same monster. Whoops. My bad. My bad. That's on me, Kenyu. If we lose this one on this one, it's on me. I'll take full responsibility. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh wait, you have the you have the tribute. Blast with the tribute. That's perfect. What is that? Ah, uh, draining shield. We're about to take 500. But blast with the tribute is perfect. Play that trap card. What the hell is that? Oh god damn it! We're gonna burn again. He keeps burning us. Ah, we burned ourselves on that one. All right, they got burned a little bit, but they healed so much. And there's our other monster. You know what? That's fine. That's fine. Because Blast with the Tribute. Boop, boop, boop. Beautiful. And a thousand damage. We're coming back in this duel. Except they still had that Swords, of course. Of course they still had that Swords. Where's my Heavy Storm? Ultimate Offering. What a great card to draw. What a great card. Okay, I'm going to set you. You have no reason to be in attack mode when they have Swords on the field. And Ultimate Offering, you're going to come in handy. Okay. Until that Swords is gone, we need to think of a better strategy. Oh, Sangam with the... Uh, don't use two-pronged attack, actually. <laughs> I was like, Sangam with two-pronged attack, and then I'm thinking to myself, like, oh, but then we have to lose a good card. Speaking of good cards, hello, other ally of justice. He just has a bunch of ally of justice cards. No! Why would you get rid of my clown? Why? My clown had a use. Once you flip it, you get a card back in their hand. You jerk. Here's another clown with the use, but this time we're actually going to get it to work, unless they use Book of Moon again, which they can't. Okay, he's completely safe. Yes, 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 you heal. But now we're completely safe, and I feel better about myself. Slowly we'll win this duel now. It's going to take some damage, but we'll be fine. We'll be fine. You know what? Yes. You know what? I'm going to do it. Uh, use the effect now. Not on Spear Creedon, because I don't want them to get a big monster back. Just on Jinzo Returner. We'll take the 100 points. We're fine. And then he can tear through the opponent right now with d double mother... You didn't have to do that, honestly. But you know what? It makes me feel safer that you did. Son of a bitch. You used the yeah, I was going to say, use my torrent, uh, my card. I don't know about using it on Mushroom Man, because you're going to be willing to give them Mushroom Man. I don't know if you should have done that. Yeah, you see what you just did, can you? You left us open, buddy. You left us open. Best Toon card? Uh, I don't know about nowadays, but Toon Dark Magician Girl was really good. Back in this day and age. Eh, this Ally of Justice deck has screwed us. Not wanting to pay 500 more? Okay. Well, I've lost all my best cards to Ken Yu's, uh... Let's call them strategies. Injection Fairy Lily doesn't work anymore. We've taken too much damage. Uh, that, this duel is over, guys. I can't do anything. I can't do anything. Oh, I had 1250 attack. Shit, I should have done that. Ah, uh, whatever. Nope, not going to activate his effect. We need him as a monster on our side. That's my bad, though. They should have lost that monster. Nope, it's fine. It's good, it's good. We're going to get a monster back. Okay, he's choosing the Ally of Justice card. That's super powerful. I'm going to choose probably Sangan, right? Oh, wait, Giant Rat doesn't count? Yeah, Giant Rat's there? Okay, Giant Rat. I'll choose Giant Rat. 
Okay, boop, boop. He kills my giant rat, and I'm gonna make him pay for doing it. Because now I can summon Dream Clown. There he is. There's my Dream Boy. And now he can kill the Ally of Justice card. Just by going in defense mode. And all of your cards are useless to us. Play at least set a card to defend ourselves. Whew, we are on the edge of death right now. Oh shit. If you don't activate if you don't activate my card, we lose. Activate ultimate offering! We can still live! Okay. He doesn't understand my new deck. I don't know if I can work with him. I'm sorry, can you? You don't want, my new deck does take a little bit more thought to work. All right, let's see. Nova, eh, Nova's a little strong. What about Vyga? Vyga might be doable. Let's try dueling him. Yeah, if we duel Vyga, it should be fine, guys. Ah, I feel sad though. We could have survived one more turn, maybe thought of something. I know, he's got the Slifer AI. I, 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 I gotta figure that out on my own. We have, we've had some really fun duels though. That duel where he won the duel with Amoeba by top taking Creature Swap will be one of my favorite moments ever. That, that'll always be one of my favorite moments. Uh, this hand's not perfect, but I wouldn't mind doing this for fun. This sounds funny. This is the strongest White Magician girl, whatever, or White Magician Pikaru. Yeah, Act 1 in Tag Force 1 is the long end. We're in trouble. I probably should have activated the effect, honestly. And let me guess, Exile Force, because you did that before. Oh, Double Marauding Captain. Aren't you special? Alright, well, I gotta figure something else now. Oh, can't do much with this, but I can eventually do something with it. I'm gonna summon the Dream Clown. I know there's a high odds that he's not gonna let Dream Clown live next turn. But if he does, I'm gonna be I'm gonna get him. And Exile Force. Grand damn it. Grand damn it? Wait. Wait a minute. He just let he didn't do anything. Oh my god, he's letting me win. I appreciate this. I activate Heavy Storm. Just in case he had a trap card. He did not, but still, you gotta be safe. I'm gonna summon you. I'm gonna play defense. Boop. Destroy you. Then we're going to attack. I'm going to attack with you first, because we have to attack Marauding Captain. Activate your effect. Ah, the Paradox Brothers duel. That's a fun duel. I remember that. And Exile Force is next. There we go. Yeah, the Paradox Brothers are a really fun duel. Odeon? What game are you playing where Odeon's in it? Okay, Marauding Captain's coming back out, which means he has he didn't even have another monster. He just did it to get rid of Dream Clown. I can kind of respect the play, but I think he's going to lose. And he's probably definitely going to lose now. I got my heart in clear water, making it so my Dream Clown's invincible. To most things. Not to all things, but to most things. And that's the end of the duel. Ah, Capsule Monsters. That's what it is. I forgot you were playing that. Yeah, Capsule Monsters is super fun. I think Falsebound Kingdom is a little more fun than that game, though. And Duels of the Roses is the best game ever. Duels of the Roses is just so much fun. Pl now that I got my friends to play it with me, it's even better than I could have ever imagined. Playing that game two players, like in a tournament, is incredible. It's so much fun. Demise King of Armageddon, that's fun. Demise King of Armageddon is a fun card. All right. 1200. I'm going to summon my Rui Kishin Clown. Uh, Dream Clown. Going to activate your effect to kill you. Boop, boop, boop. Put you back in attack mode. And the duel's over. Doesn't matter. See, this deck works, guys. It's actually really effective. I've, I've won every time I've used it in a single duel. It just doesn't work with an opponent when your partner does what he what Ken Yu does. We got, I, I have to use like really broken decks for him to win. Here, let's try, let's give him another shot. I'm going to give, I'm going to give him another shot. I want Ken Yu to do good. I really want him to succeed. So I'm going to give him another shot. Let's go ahead and use Rock. Ah, shit. Can we go first still? Yeah, all right. Never mind, Manji's a good guy. I appreciate that he's letting me go. All right, Ken Yu. We got to win this duel. I want, I want to show the world you're good. 
You gotta play well with my deck. I would set a Mushroom Man, yeah. I don't mind you setting Premature Burial, I see your intentions. Pyramid Turtle's kind of scary. Alright, let's see what we got. We got Spirit Barrier already. Yes, this was the deck with Spirit Barrier, by the way. Uh, we got Spirit Barrier, which is really good. Uh, we got Magic Cylinder, which is really good. I'm gonna trust they did. he didn't top deck a trap card that can stop Injection Fairy Lily. And we're gonna go in. Plus, he kind of wants me to attack him. I know he does. I'll take the 2,000. They'll take more. 22. Whatever he summons, I'm not afraid of. Okay, just a regular old card. Like I said, we're not afraid of it. Well, hello there, Izanagi. Yeah, I was going to say, you could look at me, but you're not going to beat me. Alright, we'll have Spirit Barrier just in case. Antier Giant might use it, though. Yeah! There goes Magic Cylinder. That's not great. He ate one of the good cards, though. That was a card I wanted him to eat. And it was Begone, Knave. I'm glad he ate that card. Alright, I hope that was worth it. It was worth it, just to get rid of Izanagi. We're running out of cards, though. Oh, God, we're running out of life points. Oh, yeah, no Spirit Barrier. We're fine. We're running out of life points, though. I haven't got my healing cards yet, so it's not working out perfectly. Dude, your hand's big enough. You don't need another card. Alright, what's he gonna do? Just set a card? Alright. Well, now that you got rid of my best spells and trap cards, I might as well just use Heavy Storm. Because I don't need Spirit Barrier that badly. And then I might as well use Burden of the Mighty. And Rainbow Flower. Yeah, we have enough life points for Rainbow Flower to still do something. Alright, so this is what we're going to do. We're going to check out to see what kind of cards... I think he might just summon another one. Another turtle, that is. But, let's see. Nope, he summoned that. That is curious. He doesn't even have a card to make it buff, but he summoned it anyway. That's interesting. And I'm not willing to pay 2,000 life points. Alright, let's see. What the hell am I going to do? I got this, so if he goes into attack mode, we'll do a ton of damage back to him. If he goes after my Rainbow Flower, but they're not taking the bait. And I have to hope my partner won't use Injection Fairy Lily incorrectly. Which is aggressively when we have low life points. I have a lot of cards that can heal us, you just got to wait for them. You also could Creature Swap a Griggle, that would give us some life points back. Can you please Creature Swap a Griggle? Just for some life points back? No, you don't want to do that? Okay. Well, now we're taking damage. Great job. There we go. Yeah, we'll win with Rainbow Flower. Alright. We could really use the heal, though. So, you know, Gr Creature Swap and Griggle would be a great combo. Dark Magician Girl of Blair. I can understand that. Those are fun partners. Alright, let's let the game can't handle with all the cards on the field. You see how it's lagging? But it's like the music isn't lagging, so it's just the game itself. Alright, well, this is going to help the duel go by a little faster. See if they have MST. Okay, maybe not. I'm gonna activate Anterior Giant's effect. Let's figure out what this card is. It was Birthright. Nothing we need to worry about. For life point reasons, we're gonna put you in defense mode, even though you're probably gonna get us killed eventually. And we're gonna start attacking. We're gonna win by attacking directly with Rainbow Flower. That's my strategy. The problem is, I don't know if my friend here is gonna be strategic as well. We should win on my next turn. Maybe not. Maybe not. Should have used Axe of Despair. I'm holding Circle to make it go a little faster. That's on me. I do have a Water Monster. Do I? Oh, I, I do run Unifrog. Good point, good point. Unifrog will help. And so does Iguchi. Alright. Blast with the Tribute does not exactly help us here. Antier Giant, you're doing work. Rainbow Flower and Unifrog direct attacks. That would be great. And we win on my turn still. Okay, we'll still win on my turn. When it finally gets to my turn, we'll win. They don't have enough life points to survive another round of this. They have to go aggressive now or they lose. Book of Life, that's a good play. But I don't think uh, you have any monsters or Skull Servants in your graveyard. Yeah, you don't have any Skull Servants in your graveyard. So that was a useless play. You just gave up the duel. 
Like I said, we were gonna win on my turn anyway, but they just gave up the whole duel. Alright, let me draw a card. And let's attack directly for game. This is basically a direct attack, right? Boop. See, we can do it, guys. We can win this duel. Oh, a Pyramid of a Light deck? That's pretty cool, Sinister Shadow. I like Pyramid of Light. That's fun. The movie was good, too. Yeah, Ken, you won, and he's so happy. All right, Ken, you, we need to take a little break, buddy. Let's go. Let's go over here. Is the store still open? I know it's a little late, but maybe. Ah, oh, yeah. Ken, you, do you like sandwiches? Maybe I'd buy you a sandwich. Just one, though. You only get one. Plus, I'm trying to get a plain sandwich so I can get a card. Nah, I didn't get a plain sandwich, so you're going to get... Oh, he might not like spicy curry, so enjoy. Oh, he's really happy. He loved it. All right, well, there we go. Let's go ahead and buy some packs for the day, guys. We need some good packs. Sadie's pack is still locked off, sadly. We'll have to work on that later. Uh, for now... Hmm. Let's go ahead and get this. I still want to get... I need more Cocoon of Evolution, that's why. Oh, okay, that's good. You never know, maybe Ken use a picky boy. Alright. Hey, I noticed Alexis's pack is open again. We could try to get Demise King. I know that's a card we're missing out on is Demise King, so I'm gonna try and get Demise King. Okay, I'm only gonna buy that many. That was a lot. Um, I still want to get more of uh, these cards. These are really good. Yeah, Blair's cards are broken. And they support a deck I like. Uh, we still need Yuria, so I'm gonna try and get Yuria. It's the one card we're missing, is Yuria. The one card we're freaking missing is Yuria. That really sucks. Uh, we don't really need the Warrior Pack anymore, but I still like to buy it, just because it's there. Alright, how many of these did I buy? Not enough. There we go. We're down to about that much. I'm gonna buy... Just a random pack. Let's see. Let's get a Jaden pack. Why not? One Jaden pack. I don't know what Armite is. Oh, <laughs> can you use Batman all of a sudden? That's what we're going with. Can you use Batman? He hates mushrooms, so he just makes people see them to understand his fear. Chaos Phantom? What's Chaos Phantom? What are you talking about? Oh, you, do you mean Raphael? I don't, I don't understand what you're talking about, you Ash guy. You gotta fill me in. Ask her a strip. No, I don't have Chaos Phantom, no. There we go. A forces, nice. Yeah, he is Mushroom Man. It makes sense. Hey, another White Magician. That's cool. Another Judgment Dragon. We already have a million of them. They made them common for some reason. Moki Moki Smackdown. Gotta love it. Those Dark Lucius cards. I don't really use those, but whatever. Maybe I will. Foxfire is actually pretty good. Nia Stall card. Let's see. Jerry Beans Man. You gotta love them. He's a fun spirit in Spirit Caller. Okay, we're only hoping for Demise King. He's the one card we don't have many copies of. Oh, we only have one of. Demise King. Demise King. I think he's a super rare, though, so he's going to be hard to get. Maybe even an ultra rare. Ah, forgive him, Maiden. Alright, let's see. Okay, Raging Area. Chain Master. We're not getting Demise King. That's upsetting me a little. Okay. I like Hysteric Party and all, but we didn't get it. Damn. Now I'm just looking for... Yeah, more... We got Ultimate Ed set level 5. That's really good. But I'm looking for more Cocoon of Evolution. I know it's a common. Oh, there it is. Okay, I saw one. I saw one. And maybe more Petite... Oh, another Howling Insect. That was valuable. Maybe a more Petite Moth, honestly. That's also another card where I don't have many of. There we go. Okay, we're good. 
Most hated GX character. Uh, maybe Bonaparte? Like, I talk shit on Bastion all the time, but that's from more of the game. If we're talking about, like, the show, probably Bonaparte. I don't like Bonaparte at all. I don't even think his toy soldier deck is that cool. It's not like Crawler where he's got these cool ancient gear golem and shit, so... Yeah, Bonaparte sucks. Brain Crusher. Come on, one more. Arm Dragon level... Oh, we got an Arhelling Insect! Perfect! Okay, we're good on those. One more Arm Dragon level 5. Do it for me. Do it for me. Come on, game. We got enough Cocoon of Evolutions now. I'm glad. I can make it for the next stream. I'll do that. This stream's not over. Don't worry. But next stream, we'll make Arm Dra uh, a perfectly ultimate great moth deck. That way, we can uh, complete the challenge. And also, also, I just really want to summon it. That'd be really cool. Doomdozer. Yeah, I got the other bugs. I got Petite Moth. I got everything we needed now. Okay, Warrior-wise, let's see. Any of these guys I recognize? I know Guilford. I know Karate Man. Alright. Element of Hero-wise... Nah, I don't really like those cards. Okay, new cards... Whoop. Whoops, new cards. Nothing? Oh no, we got Doomdozer. Alright, that's pretty good. This card cannot be special summoned except by removing two plin sex from your graveyard. Oh, this card's really good. Never mind. Alright. Looks like we're good there. Alright, let's see. We got Terrence and Pippin. Okay. Looks like a hard duel, but maybe we could try it out. Who knows? Oh yeah, I'm going to have to play a lot of stall cards in order to survive. Uh, the best stall card is actually Heart of Clear Water. That will survive. That, that'll make it... That, that will protect your monster until the time it comes. Heart of Clear Water protects it from spells, traps that target it, and uh, battle. And monster effects. I use it in this deck. I used to protect Dream Clown. So I could just use Dream Clown's effect infinitely. Ooh, Amiibo with Creature Swap on the first turn. I love it. I love it. And he actually will summon an amoeba this time. Oh, you ballsy motherfucker. Why did you play it in attack mode? I never thought he'd play it in attack mode, though. That was different. Ooh, I got gravity bind. Okay, that's the good news. But how much stars is combo fighter? Four. Perfect. Okay. Okay, I got gravity bind, and that makes me feel safe. Uh, so safe that I'm just going to go with rainbow flower and start my damage. Start building that damage. Sadly, my partner healed them, so this will take a little bit of time. Alright, main phase two. In case they somehow get around Gravity Bind, I'm going to have swords. That will also buy us some time. Hopefully, he summons his other amoeba and goes for creature swap. That would be great. That would be absolutely amazing. Not yet. Alright, let's see if he can do it. Summon, cre summon amoeba. Yeah, creature swap. There we go. That's my boy. 2,000 damage. Look at this guy. No, don't give them Rainbow Flower. Son of a person. No, don't kill our Rainbow Flower. What are you doing? Uh, I have a Gucci still, but damn it. Our strategy is to win. Granted, he did a lot of damage in one turn, so I don't hate him that much. It's just like, you're kind of slowing us down, buddy. You're kind of slowing us down. I'm going to go ahead and summon a Gucci. Activate Burden of the Mighty. That brings him down to 16. Combo Fighter's at 16. Alright, so let's go ahead and attack directly. It's only 300, but it'll do. Combo Fighter, give us back our Amoeba. I thought he was going to use Monster Reborn to bring back Amoeba and then use Shen Spy on it. I thought that was the plan. That way we could do 4,000 damage, but no. You know my partner, guys. He's not into that. Maybe I should run an Amoeba deck and show him how it's done. Griggle! Hey, I love me. I love me some Griggle. No, don't put a Gucci in defense mode. Attack with it. Dude, use Gravity Bind. Use my Gravity Bind. Please use my Gravity Bind. Please use my Gravity Bind. All you have to do is activate Gravity Bind. There's not, it's not hard. You just activate it. There you go. See, now Gucci never needed to be in defense mode. Oh, they have Royal Decree. Never mind. Everything's screwed. All my plans have been foiled. Oh god, they have Monster Reborn. Okay, well, trap cards can't be activated. That's the good and bad news. Bad, it's more bad news than good news, honestly. We're in trouble. Alright, I'm gonna just summon Dream Clown. We're fine. If we find a way to get rid of that trap, that'll be great. 
We gotta go in, technically, because we need to do damage while we have the chance. So, you handle that guy. Oh, okay. Shit, he runs Rush recklessly. Well, we're gonna do some direct damage while we can. They had to have Royal Decree, that sucks. We're gonna have to figure a way out around that. If only I could change his deck a little. Okay, Gucci's gone, but we won't take that much damage. Luckily, we stole their combo fighter when we did. Mushroom Man, that's how we win. We'll burn him with the Mushroom Man. Burn him at the stake. Granted, we have to burn too, but... It, hey, Vorse Raider! <laughs> Why in the hell would you set that... Oh, I guess it would be weaker than us. Never mind. Alright, so we could slowly win this duel with Mushroom Man number two. Unless they finally draw a card that's stronger than us. But it looks like we're in the clear for now. Give us back the Mushroom Man. We'll take 300, but they burn more, so it's fine. Rui Kishin Clown, it's time for us to actually go in. Now that Royal Decree's out and they can't possibly do anything to stop us. I'm gonna summon the Rui Kishin Clown. I designate their monster into defense mode. And we're gonna start doing some damage. Guys, I think we're gonna win. And it's probably gonna be my Mushroom Man number two. There we go. There we go. And they might not even be able to pay to give it back to us. Oh, sorry. End phase. Yes, Mushroom Man number two. I need you to burn them a little. Just a little. Don't, don't go too ham. Make them feel pain. That's all that matters. Oh no, you can't pay 500 life points to give it back and it's face up on your side of the field, which means we're going to attack it for game. Yay. Oh, not really because he could just... Oh no, he didn't put it in defense mode. So they're giving up. They just gave up the whole duel. All Kenyu has to do is attack. Can you attack for game? Mushroom Man, we won. The Mushroom Man won us the freaking duel. Hell yeah. Freaking Kenyu, everybody. Look at that. We already got him up to like two hearts. We're almost there. We're almost to a point where I can edit his deck and not suffer anymore. Uh, Let's see. This is the last place we're going to go for the night. Let's go to the volcano. It's really beautiful at night. Alright, there's Rio again. Don't really want to duel him. There's Matthew and Tristan. Meh. You know what? I have an idea. I have an idea. It's a terrible idea, but I have an idea. Let's go ahead and just leave. Hold up. Oh, he already got to his second heart. Hell yeah. Guys, it's time. Yeah, we, okay. Well, you wanted me to duel Atticus, right? Okay, I'm, I'm spamming X. I hope you're all okay with that. Because if you if you watch my uh, Aster Phoenix Let's Play, there you go. Alright, there we go. It's time for the story. Atticus Rhodes, welcome back. Say hello to my new partner. His name is Kenyu the Mushroom Man. He's probably going to team up with Yasmin, right? Yeah, he's with Yasmin, okay. Atticus Rhodes number one with Yasmin number two against Kenyu number two. I want to know what Kenyu's first deck is. Because if this is the improved deck, I want to know what the shitty deck was. Oh, Mother Grizzly's a great start. For somebody like Kenyu, Mother Grizzly's as good as we're going to get. Or Giant Rat. Alright, Pitch Black Warwolf is, Warwolf is a really good card. I used it in the last deck we used. It's basically Mirage Dragon. Yeah, she's the Gravekeeper girl. Oh, I drew Heavy Storm first turn. Game. Why you gotta be so nice to me? You're gonna make... Oh, and Mirror Force is gone. I love this game sometimes. Gonna put on Mist Body. Just in case I don't have what I need. Life points wise. Okay, Battle Phase. You attack you. I'm gonna activate my effect. Yeah, she is Gravekeeper's Assailant, but she runs a Gravekeeper deck. Yeah, and honestly, they're super good. Gravekeepers are one of the scariest cards in the uh, archetypes in the old game. So we got to be careful. There we go. It's just defense mode monster. If we could just get creature swap. Ah, uh, no. Oh, nice. You took the werewolf. Oh, shit. No traps can be activated now. That was a great play. Second Mother Grizzly. I love it. Are you going to get Karate Man out here for fun? Oh, you're giving... Okay, that's not bad either. I could see the idea. 
Oh my god. No, wait, wait, okay, that's fine. Whatever. It's fine. It's fine. Dude, stealing the Warwolf was a godlike play. That was a godlike play. Giving the Mother Grizzly actually is a really good play. We get an extra monster for that. But this is why I kind of wanted him to destroy one of his own monsters to make it happen. Because she's known for having defensive cards, and now we're in danger of losing the duel. If he gets a tribute monster, we can lose the duel right now. Mm, I did say it. Yep. I did say it. Hey there, Foxy Queen. We're in danger, everybody. Fairy Box is our only hope, and it worked on the first one. But that amoeba is a huge problem. Fairy Box? Holy crap! Freaking Kenyu is a luck god. Kenyu is a luck god. Did you just see that, everybody? Alright. Uh, obviously, Fairy Box might still come in handy. Um... He can't activate trap cards due to Warwolf. I think we just won the duel. We're doing very good, Foxy Queen. We're doing very good. Our buddy Ken Yu here is amazing. It's going to be a close duel, guys, but we pulled it off with 300 life points. Atticus, this is not your channel. This is Ken Yu's and mine. We share it. You are not shaking that ass at me today. Hell yeah. We did it, guys. Ken Yu won. And honestly, he was a vital part. He got us the Warwolf that stopped trap cards. That was freaking perfect. Oh, uh, nice job, you two. Uh, I knew it's him, yada yada. This We've done this story before. Eh, we've seen this part. Can you prove himself against Atticus? It was a close duel, 300 points. Foxy Queen, thank you so much for following me. I really appreciate that. You're super nice. I wish you could have seen the earlier part of the stream. You missed a lot of interesting stuff with Ken Yu and his Mushroom Man deck. But you know what? He's proven himself to us. He's, he's a great duelist. Man, that was such a good duel. Alright guys, it's getting a little late in the day. I do need to end the stream soon. I, around 7 o'clock for me, my time is when I need to end the stream. Before I do, I want to get one more duel out with Ken Yu. And then we're going to go buy some packs. Agreed. Agreed on the Amazon woman, 100%. Ta Tanya? Tanya? Amazing. 100%, 10 out of 10. Now let's go to the store, because that's where we're going to buy cards anyway. Oh shit, I forgot. No. Oh wait, someone's ditching class. Uh, of course it's him, no. Cyrus Truesdale. This is going to be a horrible way to end the stream. This is going to be a horrible way to end the stream. I'm sorry guys, this is this is so dumb. We can't beat them. We're not we're not strong enough to beat them, but we're gonna try. Clowny Daggers versus Cyrus and Kagamaru. Oh, we're so screwed, Ken. You you have no idea. This is this is a horrible idea. Oh nice, you got final flame. Or yeah, final flame. Do six hundred damage. That might be the only damage we do this to why did you put him in attack mode, can you? Can you? Why? Yeah, we're in trouble now, can you? Okay, hopefully my hand's better, because that was not good. Okay, I have Magic Cylinder, Injection Fairy Lily. I got all three of my Dream Clowns, which I love. Um, We're probably going to lose the duel anyway, so why not go in, right? Screw it. Screw it. Let's just go for it. What's the worst that can happen? I activate my monster's effect. Ow. We got him. All right. We got him, everybody. Let's see. Oh, my God. Look at this man's body. I think Damon has a better shape to it, but his is good, too. All right. Premature Burial. Getting the Steamroid back. Interesting idea. I'll give you that. And that Wave Motion Cannon put us on a time limit now. We have a time limit now. You got all three of your Mushroom Man number twos. Okay, and this is interesting. We just did a bunch of damage again. And finally, a trap card activates and emergency provision activates. Everyone's in defense mode now. That sucks for us. We technically have magic cylinder, so this could work if we burn them enough or if they summon a strong enough monster. But I feel like we're about to lose Injection Fairy Lily, and that's a huge loss. Oh, Drillroid. No, yeah, Magic Cylinder, save us! We're still in the duel. 
Wait, why would you attack with Miss Tomato? Why? Why are you attacking? Wait, why did Cyrus do that? Was there a card that said he had to attack? Oh my god, we just won the duel. Did Cyrus just give us the win? Like, did his AI break that hard? Oh no, we didn't win the duel! We don't have enough life points to use Injection Fairy Lily's effect! We haven't won the duel yet! Alright, if I do this, we lose- we'll lose- we can't- well, actually, we will win the duel. Okay, this is worth it. This is worth it. Okay, we already won the duel, guys. I cannot believe- this is the first time we beat Kagamaru, and it's with Ken Yu. Clowny Daggers and Mushroom Man put together. We did it. We won the duel. And this is why. I end my turn. I'll pay the 500 life points. And then they lose 300 for game. We beat Kagamaru. For the first time ever. <laughs> All we needed was Ken Yu's Mushroom Man deck. It works. It just works. The duels are really close. But it just works. I'm sorry, Cyrus. Honestly, you're a great duelist. And your partner's even scarier. But this man, this man here, is unstoppable. The Mushroom Man deck is unstoppable. Can you beat Kagamaru? <laughs> that is one hell of a way. You know what? The stream's not over. We'll buy some more packs before the stream ends. One last thing. We're going to buy some more packs before... Oh, son of a... You know what? Let's... Oh, I can't end the day. Uh, let's just... Let's leave the place. Let's go buy some packs before the stream ends. Now, everyone, if you... Tell me what packs you want me to buy. I'm probably going to buy some insect packs, but tell me what packs you want me to buy while we still have money. So go ahead and tell me your suggestions. What packs do you want to see? Unless Sadie's pack is open because we haven't got any of her cards yet. Um, no, I want to talk. Yes, I would love some cards. Where are them plant cards? The plant cards are everywhere. The plant cards are in this pack. They're in the earth pack. They're in the light pack, water pack. All the packs have it. And technically the checkered flag pack is basically all the packs. Uh, the early packs. So, this would have every card. So, give me a suggestion. Yeah, after this pack buying, we're gonna end off the stream for the day. My streams are usually three hours. I, I go from four o'clock to seven o'clock, or whatever the hell that is for you guys. I know it's different timing. I live in California, so, you know, Pacific Standard Time. You gotta, you gotta adjust to Eastern Time. It would probably be around ten o'clock for you guys. Jaden's first cards? Okay. A fresh... Wait, actually, that's a new taste. Jaden's first cards would be... Ah, uh, no, I don't know. I'll, I'll buy both. I'll buy one of each for you. Because I don't think I really have a young Jaden. Him? Yeah, he's young Jaden. Never mind. I'll buy both for you. Alright, anything else? Any other suggestions? I'm going to buy some of these for me. Because I just like the bugs. I like insect pack. Hey, welcome Foxy Queen from Canada. Uh, do you have any suggestions? Uh, you know what? I'm going to buy one of these because we want to get Yuria still. If you want me to buy more, you can ask me. But we're down to our last thousand dollars. Anybody have a suggestion? Ooh, last four medals for the tournament. I'll be seeing you, Sinister Shadow. Enjoy your enjoy playing Beginning of Destiny. It's a really fun game. Alright, I'll buy one checkered flag since there are no suggestions coming through. Oh, well, someone suggested... Uh, okay, we got one Morphing Jar pack. Someone suggested checkered flag, so luckily I bought that. Um, still have 580 bucks. That's enough to buy just about anything. Might buy... Alright, I might buy one more Bugs deal. I just really like them. I don't know what Zen cards are. The first pack, okay. We got some first pack. I'll, I'll throw I'll throw some in there. They're cheap, so I'll buy two. Um, I don't know what Zen cards are. You know what, for me... Uh, Zane cards. Ah, that makes sense. Okay, I'll buy some Zane cards. Okay, I got 150 bucks left. 150 bucks left. The next comment gets to pick it. Next comment gets to pick it. I'm watching. Oh, we got another... Okay, we got another Zane. And then I have 50 bucks left, and I'm going to use it to buy one more Beginner Monsters. Zane... Oh, yeah, Gambit, got the, Gambit got the vote. Gambit got the vote. So let's go ahead and continue and see what we got. I'm hoping for two Goblin Attack Force. Two Goblin Attack Force would be great. Spear Reaper. Sadly, it's limited to one, and we already have like a million, so... I'm not as excited as I normally would be. Hain Hain, I same. We have a million of them. Hoping for that Toon Goblin Attack Force. Come on, game. Give it to me. Love Mogaru Ram, but I want that. Toon World's good too, but no luck. Dang it. Okay, Yuria is all we care about. We have everything else. Just give us Yuria. Come on, game. 
And off the stream of Yuria. Ah, damn it. No Yuria. Okay, got some of the... I guess this is new Jaden, but I got both just to be safe. Got a lot of Glow Neos. Got Cocoon Party. We got Cocoon Veil. We got Honest, which is super freaking broken, so that's a really good card. Okay, the Zane pack. I could really use uh, another... Uh, uh, you know what? I don't know. I don't have enough Cyber Dark Fusions. Or any of the Dark Fusion monsters, so that'd be good. Cyber Dark Impact. That's a good card. That's a good card. Okay, this we're just hoping for Demise King. Demise King is all we want. White Knight Dragon's cool too. Gotta admit it, but that's all we want. Okay. Here we just need a level 5 insect and one level 7 insect. Uh, the ultimate insect. Hey, look who it is. Eh, if, I, if I have any mods still in here, do you mind taking it out? Howling insect. We already have enough of those though. It's a really good card though. Prickle Fairy, I really like too. Alright. And Man Eater Bug. Thank you, Jason. I appreciate it. Okay, checkered flag. This is going to be rough. <laughs> That's pretty funny, Gambit. Whirlwind Weasel. I think we already have Whirlwind Weasel. Hey, Burstinatrix! Hell yeah! Oh, Oversoul! That's a good card. We need that. We need that. This is. These are the Jaden cards I like. These are the cards I like. Except that one. I don't know what that is. Burst Impact. What the hell? That was like Burstinatrix going crazy. I really could use a Morphing Jar, but they're so hard to get. So I, I understand if I don't get it. Okay, we got two sushi. All right, did we get any new cards? We did. Okay, Sinister Sprocket, which I have no idea what that is. Uh, Whirlwind Weasel, which I didn't know was new. Burst Impact is ultra rare. You activate this one. Burst Interest card is face up on your side of the field. All cards on the field except seven here with Interest are destroyed, and the destroyed monsters controlled receive equal to the number of monsters destroyed by 300. Wow. This is actually a good card. This is actually a good card. We could use that. Dark Spirit Art of Greed. Tribute one Dark Monster, draw two cards. Your opponent can negate this effect by revealing one spell card in their hand. I like that card. That's pretty good. All right, let's go to Rarity then. How do our, How's our Rarity going? Honest was really good. We needed more Honest, so that was good. That was really good. Oh, Oversoul, really good. We needed that. Um, we need more. We're, de we're done with Hauling Insect now. We got what we needed. And that's about it. All right, guys, this is going to be it for the day. I really want to appre appreciate you all showing up for the stream. It's been a blast. Ken Yu has actually been a way better partner than I expected. Like, he is, he's won us duels by himself sometimes. And that by its, that, that's just a miracle to me. Like, this guy is supposedly supposed to be one of the worst duels in the game. And it just it, it just amazing to me that, this wor that he worked out. And it worked out. And he beat somebody we never beat before. So... I am going to make a moth deck for next time. Ken Yu, you're one of my favorite partners so far. Next stream will be next week on Saturday. I only can stream on weekends so far. I, um, I will try to get more streaming days uh, when I have the chance, but I am a little busy, so I apologize. Uh, Saturday will be my next streaming day. Uh, it'll be same time as today. I should have it scheduled. If you're following me, you can just go to the schedule. It'll show you when I'm streaming. Uh, it, and it, it adjusts the hours to where you're from, so I don't have to ma make confuse you. And, uh, yeah, I really appreciate you all coming today. Graham, I really appreciate you uh, gifting a subscriber. That was really nice of you. Forbidden Donut, thank you so much for subscribing. Everybody, thank you for the subs. Thank you for the follows. You guys are great. I love playing this game for all of you. I can't wait to show you guys the new decks that we're going to have for next time. I hope you enjoyed my clown deck, and I hope you enjoyed all my other stuff. Uh, all my other decks with the, the red eyes and the black skull dragon. So next week, there's going to be more streaming for TAC Force 3. I stream every weekend. You don't have to worry. I do three hours, usually about three hours. See you next time, Foxy Queen. Thank you so much for joining our group. And we got another gift, and this one goes to Gambit R6 at the very end. Gambit R6, I hope you are excited. You are going to be going, and you are going to be... Th honestly, Graham, thank you so much. You're, so, you're such a nice person. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Uh, so next week you're going to be able to use the emotes and stuff. I, I hope you enjoy the dream clown. That's really fun. See y'all next time and bye bye Hey, you got the 90 medals. Good on you, Sinister Shadow and Graham. You're awesome.